Dude, OSHA can shut the fuck up. You know what I mean, dude? <laughs> you know what I mean, dude? Like, come on, man. I built most of the goddamn, like, foundations for my house out of very dense gelatin. And I'm still alive. None of it's made out of rock. None of it's made out of concrete. It's all just jello. Really dense jello. And I'm still alive so far. They ruined the asbestos fake snow industry. The fuckers. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. Who cares if this hallway in this intro picture collapsed on top of eight to nine children while they were on a field trip through the old dam? Who freaking cares, dude? It's not my problem. They were making too much noise. They agitated the rocks. They had exactly what was coming to them. Besides, they would have died of asbestos poisoning within a couple more days anyways. More like... Oh, shut up. <laughs> oh. Oh, my God. Oh, my God, dude. Oh, my God. OSHA is a federal operation to funnel tax money. I'm on to them, brother. Ah, uh, you and me both, brother. Look, why would I want, why would I want my building to be as the same as someone else's building? Don't we want our buildings to be unique? I want my building to have walls that surprise you <laughs> when you lean on them. And sometimes when you lean on them, you fall into like a saw trap-esque situation when you fall through the wall. This is my country, all right? And my goddamn wall systems. Although technically this game doesn't take place in uh, the US. It takes place in a made up country that doesn't exist. Called like Stalin, I think. <laughs> Called like Stalin, which is the most made up sounding country I've ever heard of in my entire life. <laughs> Stalin. You mean Canada? It's kind of like Canada. Look, this game is, uh, we'll have a fun time in this game. I'm not going to beat it. Don't even ask me to beat it. Because somehow this game, you would look at it and you'd say, oh, this is probably like a four hour game. But when you look it up, it says it takes 35 hours to beat. So like, uh, probably not a beat it on stream kind of game. Probably more of a play it for, uh, play it for like the first act kind of game. But, uh. You know, maybe I'll be fast. I've got a guide open. So, I mean, maybe I'll be faster than a normal person. Like Inscription? Inscription takes like eight hours to beat. This game takes, uh, literally 24. Literally. Literally 24. OSHA workers don't use guides, though. I thought they did. I thought that was quite literally the one thing you were supposed to do with OSHA is like follow the rules and the guide. Bad Bowman, thanks for the five gifted subs. Nah, they just eyeball it. All right. Well, that makes this easier. Look, chat. The thing is, while we may not beat this whole game, what we will get is endearing RP of me walking up to every piece of geometry in the map and yelling, this ain't up to code. I've basically spoiled the entire stream. It's gonna be a lot of me pulling out my camera and taking a picture of like a fucking corner of like a, a fucking rock and being like, this ain't, this ain't how, ha how it's supposed to be. That's a ticket. And I'll write a ticket in real life. Yep, that's not up to code. That's gonna be the strike. Why would you spoil it? What do you want from me? This sounds like a stream for the history books. Well, it's one of the last ones you're ever going to get. 
because I'm retiring like tomorrow so I mean I'd enjoy it if I were you can I have your emotes over my dead fucking body spum over my dead goddamn body what day is it today huh what day is it today you little piece of shit you little goblin what day is it today go on I already did the message well say it again because I didn't read that one Come on, do the thing you do all the time. Come on. Come on. Say the line. <laughs> say the line, Spot, say the line. Say the line like you always do. I missed it last time. Hey, tomato, long time lurker, first time chatter. Just wanted to say happy Nova Scotia Heritage Day. Oh, hell yeah. That one's not actually as, like, fucking funny as some of the other ones are. Because that's just, like, sort of like a, a just a day. Um, hang on. I feel like I missed the one yesterday, too. Let me check. Um, let's see. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 19th spot said, Happy National Vet Girls Rock Day? The fuck even is that? What does that mean? What? Only girl vets. <laughs> no boys allowed on that one. No boys allowed. None. Like veterinarians or like veterans? I don't know. I literally wake up early for this bit. I just want you to know that. I know, and then you leave. <laughs> it's really fucking wild, actually. I've got, like, I'm looking here at the chat logs, and it's pretty much you wake up, you post it, you get some free fucking clout, and then you leave. It's, you're doing your, like, dailies. Your fucking daily MMO quest. You wake up every day and you fucking turn on my stream to post your thing and then you walk away. Getting my tomato rep. Hey man, more power to ya. More power to ya. Chad, I almost did the big uh, backroom stream today, but I decided against it because I think I'm gonna do the big backroom stream tomorrow. I actually found out why I couldn't beat the last level. The sewer one? I was looking for an exit on the walls when in fact I should have been looking for an exit in the ground. There's like a, it's like some real bullshit. It was a manhole. We were supposed to be looking for a manhole, not a fucking door. We were looking for a manhole. I never looked at the ground one time when I was playing that level. Not once did I look at the goddamn ground. So, yeah. You said you were retiring. Yeah, from playing good games. The doy. Stupid idiot, but Gramps told you to follow the pipes. Yeah, but Grandpa was actually an OSHA agent. And in reality, he wasn't talking about the back rooms at all. He was talking about the back rooms of the old dam... And when you follow these pipes, you just find a cave-in, as you can see from the picture. Because Grandpa didn't know how to design hallways. The pipes lead to, uh, structural, you know, issues with the dam. This is an ominous message. Uh, I'm gonna read it out. It's- it goes, Woo! Finally! I love this game. Mostly. What does that mean? <laughs> Mostly? <laughs> what's the, what's the, um, what's that, what's that part at the end for? Mostly. I mostly love this game. Up until the one moment. You are armed with a camera, good luck. Dude, my character is just about as powerful as the character from Outlast. 
which is to say not powerful at all. The thing is, I look chat, this game is a scary game. Uh, subjectively. If you think that structural uh, integrity uh, faults are scary, if you think that the idea of um, bad infrastructure is scary, then this is a fucking scary goddamn game. This is like, chat, chat, basically what we're going to be doing is we're going to be playing on the ground floor of someone's really bad city skylines level. Like some fucking idiot that didn't know how to do fucking anything in city skylines or like Sim City, we drop down onto the ground floor of their fucking shit stained buildings like system that they made. Like someone, we're like down on the ground floor of their bullshit and we're taking pictures. So imagine like the horrible fucking garbage world that you made where like you thought for some reason making 18 roundabouts consecutively in a row was a good idea. I'm down there on ground floor with the goddamn picture camera, and I'm taking pictures of why it's a bad idea for you. Okay? It's not? No. Roundabouts are never a good idea. <laughs> Take it from me, guy in Massachusetts that has roundabouts. They're never a good idea. They never work. Roundabouts always suck. No one knows how to use one. No one gets it. Not actually true. Oh, yeah? Because someone else in chat just said actually sadly true. So I'm going to uh, pay attention and agree with the one who said the thing that's uh, agreeing with what I said. So how about you shut the hell up? They work. It's just the people using them are stupid. Well, yeah, so why incorporate any street systems that require people to have brains? Because God knows you don't need a brain to have a car and drive. So why would you ever bother adding anything with enough complexity to slow anyone down for a second? Because God knows 90% of the people behind those wheels will never get it. And then they'll stop and seize up traffic like they do every time. I've never been to a roundabout where someone hasn't um, done something stupid. They filter traffic faster than stoplights and junctions. Yeah, if everyone knows how to use them and has a brain. Which again, allow to- Please loop back to the previous 30 seconds where I explain why that- That lovely thought is nothing but a pipe dream here in America, brother. I was almost killed on a roundabout. Dude, I know how to use roundabouts because I live on the East Coast and they're everywhere out here. You can't go more than 10 feet without finding a roundabout out here in Massachusetts. And even now, I'll fucking see some idiot do some insane shit on the roundabout and I'll see their license plate and I'll say like Jersey on the back of it. And I'll be like, you fucking little rat. <laughs> Just don't go near the roundabout, dude. If I see someone do some insane roundabout shit and then I see their license plate and it says like, I'm here from Texas, <laughs> I get mad, man. It's like my favorite hobby is to watch a driver do something fucking completely wild and then like squint and look at their license plate and it says like Hawaii. I'm like, how the fuck? What's even happening? How did you get here? Why are you here? Texas only knows straight flat roads. Mild terrain features will make them panic. Dude, look. It isn't their fault. Actually, it kind of is. I feel like people should do research on the places they're driving to and through and understand the uh, road rules of the place they're going and know that if their course takes them through a roundabout, they should know how to navigate the roundabout before they get there so they don't have to freestyle it live. 
Because as far as I'm concerned, people view the yield signs at roundabouts as floret signs. And basically, basically roundabouts are 50-50 coin flip to see if someone's going to get rear-ended by someone else. Because no one yields at the yield. They kind of just go, ooh, my turn, and just kind of fucking get in there. Drift circles. <laughs> Yield sounds like giving up. Americans don't do that, brother. You're right. If there's one thing I know about America, it's that we don't do that, brother. or when they break for the yielder. Yeah, hell yeah, dude. I've seen that happen too. I've seen some fucking asshole from like Michigan or something, some Michigan license plate. Straight up on a roundabout, I'm behind them going towards like the spot I'm tearing off and I see them fucking break for the yielder. Dude, the person that's trying to merge, they break for them and let them in. I'm sitting here like you just stopped. I'm, I'm waiting to hear and feel someone either rear end me or I'm going to hear a rear end happen way in the back and then everyone's going to get bonked into each other and then I'm still gonna get bonked into in the end, like dominoes. Unbelievable. <laughs> Happens more than you'd think. And that's why I don't think roundabouts should exist. Because the odds are too high that someone doesn't know how to navigate them and causes a traffic problem that therefore completely overrides any kind of additional speed you'd gain from the roundabout. Okay. <laughs> Even if it's partially slower, most people, I assume, know what a red light means. And what a yellow and actually no yellow's too much for some people. Yellow's hard for some people. Some people don't get that one. But like green and red. Yellow means go faster. <laughs> yellow means go again, right? Yellow means pedal to the metal. Let's get the let's get out of here. <laughs> I get. I, dude, I sweat when I see people fucking floor it when the light goes yellow, dude. I get nervous, dude. The general public just has a skill issue, SMH. True. Traffic school stream. Look, dude, I don't do a lot of driving, but holy hell, sometimes out there, I look like the best driver in the goddamn country compared to some of these people. It's baffling. You'd think I would look bad since I don't drive much, but I guess it's my gamer senses. I guess uh, gaming has made me, has improved my logical skills. It's all the VR training <laughs> and my Mario Kart skills. <laughs> I'm just built different. Might be the lack of comfort. What, you think people get like a little bit calm and chilled out behind that wheel and it makes them make mistakes like fucking idiots? Probably, actually. That's probably true. I don't know, man. I think all you really need to do to like really get everyone to stop making mistakes on the road is like hook up like electric dog collars to everyone's like necks when you get into a car like automatically the car fucking has like a micro taser in the back of the seat all right they make a mistake zap them <laughs> they'll stop making mistakes really fast and get everyone like bumper car uh like bumpers you know what i mean like zap them and bumper car bumpers like a bumper car right two at the same time you know so if you bump into someone, it's fine. Mm. 
Masochists love tomato cards. Shut up. It's not about that. It's about fucking hurting someone for doing something stupid. <laughs> Alright, that sounds a lot worse. That sounds worse. That wasn't how I wanted that to come out. Just give everyone self-driving cars. Well, I mean, like, the problem with self-driving cars is that everyone thinks that that means they drive perfectly forever in all situations. And then you see stuff on the news about a self-driving car, like, running down, like, an entire sidewalk full of people by accident because the person leaned back into the back seat to eat a sandwich. They don't really drive perfectly. They're not really made for that. But it came out. It's kind of irresponsible, I think, for people to label like driving AI as self-driving and not driving assistance. You know what I mean? Like, I think it's kind of irresponsible to name it that. When there's always an asterisk at the bottom that says, hey, uh, please keep your hands on the wheel and please stare at the road the whole time, dude. Because like, honestly, this thing will for real steer into people by accident. Like it just does it sometimes. I don't know if it wants to or not, but sometimes it just aims for people on the road. It wants to. We can't ever tell anyone that the car driving AI we made Whenever we put a human cutout on the road In one lane and an empty lane in the other lane The car always aims for the human cutout Every single time We don't know why We keep trying to change it But it keeps aiming for human cutouts And then a point multiplier appears on the LED screen in the car it Says you get 100 points Which is weird It's probably a Decepticon. Dude, honestly, I'd buy a car that could turn into a Decepticon. Aside from the fact that, man, it's gotta be a real bummer to have, like, Deception in your name. Like, Decepticon, Deception. Kind of, kind of, uh, like, what the fuck's an auto? What does Autobot mean, you know? Like, what, like, Decepticon, I always assumed is, like, oh, Deception. What does Autobot mean? Like, what's the, what's the word on that one? Automatic good guys. <laughs> Autonomous. So one side gets like robot man and the other side gets bad guy robot. <laughs> That's not fair. Decepticons just got fucked, dude. Life isn't fair. No wonder they're evil. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. If I got named f fucking Starscream, I got Scream put in my name, and then I also got put into the faction called, like, Mean Bad Guy, I would also be a mean bad guy, you know? It's like being put into, like, Slytherin. Like, of course I'm gonna be angrier about that. I sound like a fucking asshole from day one. And, like, every teacher looks at me like I'm an evil guy. And, like, everyone's- everyone has to look angry, like, all, all the time. How would you bully Harry Potter? I'd take his glasses, I'd stomp him into the fucking ground. I'd take his stupid fucking glasses and I'd stomp him. I mean, if I'm going to be a bad guy, I might as well do it right. Good luck casting spells at what you can't see. Yeah, exactly. 
Imagine needing glasses with all that magic around. I mean, undoubtedly, Harry is a fuck up, right? Like, he is a fuck up. Why didn't they just aim for the glasses? I don't know, dude. Like, I don't know. Here's the thing about magic. Like, I don't give a shit what Harry says. If he points his wand at me, I'm gonna grab it and I'm gonna break it in half with my hands. I'm gonna drop the two pieces on the ground. I'm gonna punch him in the nose. And then I'm gonna cast magic to make him shit himself. Like, I don't, you don't need to use magic to get to the end game part where you cast magic to make him like shit his pants. You know, like you, you can beat the, you can beat him up and then do that. Like you don't, I don't understand why it was always like magic versus magic when it should have been Harry cast fucking like expecto murder attack and I charge past the spell and punch him in the throat. Hard to say stuff when you can't breathe because you got punched in the throat. Idiot. That's all I'm saying. But either way, I would have never become a magic person because um, the idea of being stupid enough to run into a fucking, like, run full speed into a wall in public would have been enough to deter me from magic forever. That just would have never happened. Like, at a certain point, dude, I like to think that the entire fucking movie didn't happen. Like, none of the books, none of that crap ever happened. Because what really happened in my head canon is some fucking asshole at, like, the goddamn, like, train station was like, Yeah, <laughs> yeah, the magic station? Run through that wall as hard as you can. And, uh, you'll get there. And then Harry fucking full speed ran himself into and got a horrible, horrible concussion. He's been in a coma ever since. Like, you have it coming if you do that. Like, for real, though. <laughs> he dreamt it all. Weren't some spells non-verbal? I don't care, nor no. Look, dude, I would have gotten into potion crafting, okay? Because potion crafting, now that's where the money's at. Spells, who fucking cares? Potions, now that's where the cash is. That's where the money is, you know? That's where the money is. Alchemy is where the money is. None of, the, none of this other crap matters. How about potion selling? Exactly. 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 Yep. <clears throat> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Only the strongest. Yeah, you'd make a great Slytherin. Dude, honestly, First of all, no way I'm putting that grody fucking hat on my head. For starters, I bet it's sweaty. Like, I bet it's sweaty on the underside. I'm not putting that on my goddamn head. Like, if some old bag walked out and was like, you have to put this on your head so it can fucking bully you in front of everyone in the entire school, I'd be like, yeah, fuck you. I'll just, like, pick one. I don't think it really matters. He just doesn't like being washed. It's kind of like hat-based hazing. It really is just hazing. Cause you know if you got like Hufflepuff, everyone's like, <coughs> fuck up, cringe. <laughs> the, the, kid's a, the kid's a fucking idiot. <laughs> Hufflepuff might be the most embarrassing sounding fucking name ever. Well, genuinely embarrassing. Huh. 
Huffle These Puffs. For some reason, whenever I hear Hufflepuff, I just think about someone huffing farts. All right, and that's weird and embarrassing, and I'd avoid that person. That's the exact kind of person that's put into a fucking place like Hufflepuff. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> I mean, they would, and you know what? That's what I'm saying, dude. Look, all I know is that some of the Harry Potter games had like wandering students and stuff in them. Harry Potter, Prisoner of Azkaban on the PS2 did. I mean, yeah, and I, and there was Hufflepuffs that's like wandering around and you could like run up to one and I shit you not, at one point I run up to one, I ran up to him and I shoved them off of one of these staircases into like the infinite stairwell where all the stairs shift around and they fucking died. And like no one got rid of their body. No one, no one got rid of them, no one cared. No one. And I took some jelly beans off of their fucking corpse. It's like none of the teachers would walk up to do anything because they were like, ah, so back off, that's a Gryffindor. That's Harry. Don't go near that guy. That's Harry. I stole their beans, which was currency, and then I left. You know? But did you care? No. Why would I? Essentially, the Hufflepuffs were subhuman as far as uh, Hogwarts was concerned. Like, as far as Hogwarts, the, like, school was concerned, Hufflepuff is subhuman. Like, they, they are not, like, chat, I shit you not, dude. Chamber of Secrets, if only Hufflepuff people were getting eaten by that big snake. Wouldn't have heard a fucking word of it. 90% of Hufflepuff could fucking die and like no one okay no one would even bother caring okay like people would give less of a damn like if 18 Hufflepuff people documented were ripped to shreds and devoured in the middle of a hall Fucking Dandolf, whoever the hell's the headmaster of the goddamn school, would probably care more if he heard that Dobby got, like, his toes stubbed as he was walking down the halls later that day. <laughs> you mean Ganondorf? Yeah, that's what I was trying to say. Thanks. I want to attend Gandalf school, please. Yeah, dude, honestly, honestly, if you just take Lord of the Rings as evidence, Gandalf was a fucking pretty beans wizard, dude. Honestly, didn't really seem to be very good at a lot of it. I'm not going to say he can't do it. I'm just going to say he, he didn't seem like he really had it all together. Because, like, I swear, the whole time, dude, uh, look, dude, all I'm saying is, like, the fucking fact that Gandalf at the beginning of the book wasn't like, dude, okay, Frodo, take my hand. I'm just going to wizard us right to the mountain right now. I am a literal god. According to according to all of my fans in Tomatoes Twitch chat, I am a literal god. Allow me to summon the means to just take us straight to that volcano. Like, the fact that Gandalf, the super omega magic wizard, looks down to Frodo, the little fuck up, and he says, Frodo, I'm gonna need you to, like, fucking take, like, a five-year hike uphill the whole way to the Death Mountain and dump this piece of shit ring in the lava for me. I would have been like, Gandalf, are you fucking kidding me? Teach me some magic, at least. Like, do something. You got something for that? You got so anything? For that, like, I'm not, well, I'm not doing that walk. Like, <laughs> it's like your friend giving you like a package to deliver. Like, dude, I really need you to deliver this package to me. But like, he's sitting in his like million dollar Porsche when he gives you the like the package, and he's like, I need you to take this five towns over for me on foot. Anyways, bye. And he tears away. Do 
Dude, fucking Lord of the Rings chatlets frothing at the mouth right now. <laughs> Outing themselves as nerds. Embarrassing. Embarrassing. What's your opinion of Dom Tom Bombadil? Dude. Fucking banging name, dude. Hell yeah. But all I have of, of an opinion of him was summoning him in uh, Lord of the Rings uh, Battle for Middle Earth, I believe. And him, uh, I believe, actually grabbing a goblin by the throat and breaking it, breaking his whole neck in uh, one squeeze of his hand. I was like, damn, Tom Bombadil. Damn. My man. Dude, the lore is he could beat Sauron, but he'd get bored of it halfway, though. Tom Bombadil or Gandalf? Because, like, I don't know, simultaneously when it came to, like, Gandalf, like, going, you shall not pass, and, like, fucking slammed his staff into the ground and fell forever, I was also thinking, like, Gandalf, like, dude, like, you had, you guys had such a lead on this thing, like, for real, you probably could have just gone through that tiny little door at the top and gotten away. Like, I don't know, it just feels like a lot of bullshit. Like, next time, don't write a god into your story if you're gonna have them be a complete fuck-up for 90% of it, and then show up with, like, a different co Like, finally, show up, and he finally washed his, like, clothes. You know what I mean? Like... <laughs> All he did was, like, wash his clothes, dude! And then show up with a horse! Okay? <laughs> I bet Tomato liked the Hobbit movies more. I never watched them. Even I know those are bad. But I did watch the, uh, the old animated version where the Hobbits all had, like, fucking whole, like, really wild art. I did watch the old, old animated movies. Oh yeah, the old, old ones. Where they, uh, where they would sing. Where there's a whip, there's a way. <laughs> Dude, honestly, if everyone was singing all the time when they marched around, I'd probably be happier. It would probably make it, make the marching more tolerable. Although I didn't think the whip was necessary. Well, I guess it would make less sense in the song if there was no whip, but yet they made a way. Because then the song really wouldn't make any sense. It's what provides the way. Yeah. Bear Ma, thanks for the thousand bits. Greetings, Red Man. Dirty VOD boy here. Just wanted to say that you're the shit. And honestly, keep me going some days. PS intros are great. And talk D&D &D all you want. Not it. I'm done with D&D, &D, but thanks. Don't talk about it anymore, dude. Thanks for that thousand bits. That was a typo. They meant your shit. Katie, can you grow the hell up? <laughs> MNCC, thanks for the 500 bits. Uh, yeah. <laughs> but have you watched the finished Lord of the Rings? You can see Gollum's balls in that one. Chat. Y'all think I'm gonna get DMCA'd for pulling up a still of Gollum's balls from the Finnish Lord of the Rings? Is that illegal? Is that against the rules? Look, dude, all I'm gonna say is that's kind of not accurate that Gollum was as scrawny and gross as he was, because let me tell you what, I've attempted to crawl around like a Gollum or like a goblin or some kind of ghoul before, and the amount of core strength that requires is truly not, it, his body just isn't accurate to how much core strength he needs to move around like that. Like, he, it's just not visually accurate. Like, it takes like more energy to crawl around like that than it does to walk like a human. Straight up. So like, I'm just saying, dude, Gollum could have probably benched any one of us, perhaps more than us. Like, more than all of us.
he kills orcs. Look, dude, all I'm saying is that, you know, that, that, that fight at the end of Lord of the Rings where Gollum tries to grab the thing from, uh, the ring from Frodo and then rips his whole arm off, uh, should have been a lot more one-sided. All right. Frodo and Sam didn't stand a goddamn chance against him with how strong his fucking core was. Spoiler! Oh, go fuck yourselves, chat! Go fuck yourselves! Oh, really? Add a keck W to that while you're at it, all right, you little shits? Dude! <laughs> I was gonna watch it tonight. I feel like at this point on the internet, you can't know, like, the ending. You can't not know the ending of Lord of the Rings. Like, the base trilogy at this point. I feel like it's impossible to not have just parsed that at some point culturally. You know what I mean? Like, it's not even a spoiler to the film. It's a spoiler to the books as well. It is just, like, such a cultural... I really didn't want... I'm, I'm sorry. <laughs> but, uh, hey, now you've gotten there. You're welcome. I don't feel bad for you, though. Make no mistake. This isn't, like, a sorry of, like, sorrow. I'm sorry that I had to be the one to do it. You've unlocked the lore. Save, saved you eight hours. <laughs> saved you eight hours of a movie or like, uh, you know, many more of a book. You're welcome. Try 12. Yeah, I mean, and then more. How long is it to watch all the extended versions? Because that's the version that most people say you're supposed to watch, even though I would say some of the extended versions of those movies are uh, boring to the point of me wanting to tear my hair out. Mauled. Take that back. I'm 12, by the way. Why would you say that? <clears throat> Look, dude. All I'm going to say is that, like, if you want to watch the definitive Lord of the Rings experience, go find, like, the video of, like, all of us playing the Lord of the Rings game mode in Warcraft 3 because that's pretty much the movies. We pretty much got there and I would say the ending was better. I would say our ending was better because we had more cool characters at the end. Hey, Unreal Tick Games. Thanks for the gifted sub. I appreciate it. Thank you very much. That's so goddamn kind of you. You're really kind. That's really fucking nice of you. Thanks. I appreciate that. I really do. <laughs> no problem, man. No problem. Oh my God, Chad, I've had to sneeze like crazy today. I've had to sneeze so dang much. Oh. Fucking do it. I did, you just didn't hear it. I did. I need to get caffeine. I think I need, I think I actually will need to get like a five hour energy. Oh, I don't want to. I don't want to, but I will. I got it. I got it. Chad, I got bullied yesterday for eating, uh, for saying that I eat pizza with a fork and a knife sometimes. Is that wrong? Like, not all pizza with a fork and knife, but like some. If, I, if I'm feeling like... If I'm feeling like I don't want to get fucking grease all over my whole body. But, like, here's the thing. Here's a wild thing. Is that that person that was bullying me then followed it up by explaining that they... And, th 
And this shook me to my entire core. Um, so brace yourselves. Because the same, because this is now what I, how I view people that shame people for eating pizza with forks and knives, is that person then explained that they eat eclairs, but only the ends. They don't eat the middle. So they eat the side of it and then the other side of it, and they leave this sad middle piece in the middle. And uh, <laughs> they give it to someone else at that point, who is then, I guess, eats the middle of the eclair, and then uh, the eclair kind of just like explodes, like all the cream of it explodes out because it's no longer a side on the other side to contain it anymore. So I'm going to say that that opinion invalidates anyone that ever says that I can't eat pizza with a fork and a knife. Sorry, you've been brought down. You've been brought low by the power of uh, hearing the opinions of other people that, uh, that that get angry about me eating stuff with a pizza with a fork and a knife. <sighs> Still weird though. Dude. Sorry I don't want my hands to be greasy. Sorry I don't walk around with Cheeto dust all over me all the time. Like some of you fucking absolute degens. All right? Just wash your hands. Chat, think about this. How much time do you waste in a day doing all of your stupid bonus things you have to do to clean yourself off after you live like a complete slob for 90% of the time? Think about it. Why not simply cut out all the parts we have to do that by not ever having that situation to begin with? Like one minute? Now do the math. How many days are you going to be alive for, chat? Now start doing the math, chat. Do the math. How many days do you think you're going to be alive for in your life? Go ahead and do the math. All right. And then multiply how many minutes you really spend every day doing that stuff. And then multiply it by the amount of days you're going to be alive for. And then you'll find out how much time you just lost. Fool. Tomato doesn't shower. Oh, I shower. Oh, I shower. All right. I also maximize my time in the shower by bringing my pizza and my fork and my knife into the shower where they belong. Because then when I get pizza all over me in my hands, because I'm eating my pizza with a fork and a knife in the shower, I just wash myself off. I've got a shower fork, what of it? Yeah, I got a shower fork. What are you gonna do, arrest me? <laughs> I'd like to see you try. Soggy pizza. Dude, the pizza never touches the water. Besides, pizza has grease in it, and that means that the water bounces right off. Grease and water don't mix very well. So obviously, I could put my pizza underneath the water and use it almost like an umbrella, and the water would never pierce the pizza. <laughs> See, I just rest easy knowing that one fucking idiot paused right when I said that and was like, this is how I'm gonna do it from now on, and walked off to start it. Like, to start living like a fucking absolute freak. And they'll never hear this part. <laughs> Coat yourself in grease and you can fly. Only when it's raining. <laughs> only, only when it's raining, though. That's a rule. It's gotta be raining. Dude, there's nothing wrong with having a fork and knife and spoon available at all times, like in a holster on your body, all right? There's just nothing wrong with it. I'm doubling down. You're weird. You can't say that if you're not gonna use proper fucking punctuation and spelling. You disqualified yourself. Next. Next one. Er weird. Er weird. Er stopped. Er wired. Er word. 
R word. Suck self. Yeah, well. Yeah, well. What can I say? Y'all want to check out some OSHA complaints? I'm gonna go to the bathroom. When I come back, we're gonna deal with, uh, we're gonna deal with some violations. Someone, someone built an entire city, but they didn't build any of it to code. And then it fell on top of them. And now I gotta take pictures of it. I'll be right back. We can hear you. What are you talking about? No, you can't. You think I'm an idiot? You guys would be Hufflepuffs. All right, anyways, let's play Infra. You're a Gryffindor? Don't fucking kid yourself. Don't fucking kid yourself. Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up, it's embarrassing. You're not a Ravenclaw either, don't. Just don't. Just don't. Fuck you, take the official test live on stream. Dude, I don't need to take an official test, because if they try to put that fucking hat anywhere near me, I'm gonna punt it away. Okay. Let's play Infra. This is what you are, small. A small idiot. That's what you are, small. Small! Infra. New game. Hope you guys wrote down all the notes about OSHA while we were setting up, because you're gonna need to remember all of them. Okay? This ain't a joke. This ain't a... easy game. Oh, hey, Mark. Were you here all night? Boss? You talking like a robot? As usual... It... I've just been drinking the complimentary milk. Everyone? This is how I imagine businesses have meetings. Morning, everyone. Morning. Good morning, boss. Good morning. morning. Yeah, morning. And sorry for the early meeting. Mm -hmm. I have a feeling we might. I'm just gonna be playing on my phone. Us, so we better start early. Mm -hmm. So which building did you accidentally uh, demolish this time? <laughs> Going through the options, boss. Don't, don't worry about me. We'll be here all day, but some of the places you're about to serve oh! are in exceptionally bad shape. So we Wait, might as well what's be happening? prepared for the worst. Also. The maintenance reports we received from the municipality council yesterday seemed incomplete. Oh my god. So either those reports have gone missing, or there never was any maintenance done to begin with. Oh my god. Huh, sounds great. Exactly. There was no so maintenance done. careful out there, and I want everyone wearing their helmets today. That means you too, Mark. But enough chit-chat for now. Okay. Mark, why don't you go ahead and start the presentation? 
You're better with computers anyway. You got it, boss. Here we go. <laughs> All right, everyone. Welcome to the uh, meeting today. Um. Uh, for the net. What was the fuck did I say? National right. Consulting. Gr I can't fucking see this. Net. <laughs> fucking hang on. National Consulting Group pre-inspection briefing, assessing the current. Hard? Shut the fuck up. Time to wake up and up. start the presentation. God, you're bald. Assessing the current state of key water-related infrastructure Mark, in the- I know you hate early mornings, but seriously, we have work to do. Infrastructure in the Stahlberg region. We got botulism in the water! Everyone, all right. it's not a- A quick recap of the situation. Wait. As you all should know, he cut me off. Following the He's doing it without me. Year and <laughs> local council elections, there have been some hey! changes in the maintenance services of the Stalberg. Fine, region. whatever. It was decided that all you play it this way? including power I'll just play on my phone. Systems will now be maintained by us. Do we really need to hear all this again? Well, not really. I just thought it would be a good idea to jog your memory a bit, you know. Anyway, like I said earlier. There were some missing details about the state of these buildings. Uh huh. That's why you'll be having a field day today, surveying these places. Yep. Going OSHA. I'm sure. Gonna check out the state of all these buildings. That is in need of urgent maintenance. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. If those bridges crossing the Plow Wedge River are any indication, I expect to see some pretty nasty stuff. Yep. Yep. I hope not. The city council doesn't have much money to spare. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. We don't have money. Anyway, next slide, please. So, You're the one doing it, sir. Earlier, like you took my, you took the clicker. Locations today. Oh wait, there's Steve, me. You'll be taking the Plow Wedge hint. River. Pacific. I'm taking that spot right. that says Mark. Carla and Amit, you'll get to visit the two gorges dam. The view from the top is supposed to be pretty yeah. spectacular, yeah. so the gig isn't without its benefits. Naturally. Looks like I get to visit the dam too. Looks like I get to visit the dam too. Hammer Valley Dam. Oh, and there are. You're sending me to uh. So don't forget to bring your flashlight. You're sending me to. Sounds like a great way to spend the sunny day. Agent forty-eight. Agent forty-seven. Oh, very funny, Mark. Haha. Slide. I made that. All right. Oh, that would be the gist of it. Mark, you can go ahead. I made a meme. Get your gear from upstairs, and you can leave when you're ready. I still have a few things to go over with Steve, Carla, and Amit. Okay. Sort of sus that uh, you're sending me out first, especially when you're sending me to um, the scary dam. All right, I'll show myself out. Lewis, good to see you. Working hard over there, Lewis. Lewis, what are you playing at? Huh? What is that? Are those diagrams? Diagrams or something, Lewis? Taking a picture of this. Taking a picture of that. Click. Lewis, open the door. Lewis. Lewis, open the door for me now. Lewis. 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 Hey. Guess he can't hear me. That's fine. We'll make him hear me. Where the hell am I? Where's my office? I gotta find my office. Uh, I think I'm fan. I think I'm like important, so I have like a real office. I don't think I have one of these cubicles for like normals. Like I don't have a cubicle for normal people. Dan, while you were on vacation, we built you a box for it. Hope you like it. This would be the worst thing to come back from anything to see. My, I said, the smile would fade from my face almost instantaneously as I realize I have to move a bunch of boxes to get to my fucking cubicle. Hey. Hey, Rachel? Rachel? I don't want to have to tell you that's a violation for OSHA, but that's a violation for OSHA. No, how about you clean up your shit? I tip over her mug of coffee on, the, on her desk and I storm out. See, this guy's working. Now, this is this guy's actually working. This is what actual working looks like. right there, Mark? Yeah, I'm feeling fine. 
Someone that's actually working, it, sh it should look like this. All right, he's only on, he's on fucking PowerPoint, chat. That's what a PowerPoint looks like when you're actually working. Uh, this is where we store artifacts. This is a fully, uh, this is a, a three inch thick lead container. Uh, anyways, I still don't know where my office is. I don't have clearance for this hallway, even though I seem to be a very important member of this company. Uh... Hey guys, what's up? Won't be coming to work soon. Feels what's like up? Car can't take much more. Yeah, my Why car's been having. Transport. You live right next to a train Hey guys, what's up? Anyway, guys, a metro station. Hey, <laughs> it's me. The tunnels. I wouldn't take the metro hey. even if you paid me to. Actually, the company will pay half of the regional ticket for you. you guys really? having a good? Yeah. How you guys doing today? Yeah. Saves you a fair bit of money in the long run. Oh hell yeah! I've been I've been actually thinking about like taking good. the I've been yeah, I've been thinking about taking the uh, rails as well. Oh come on! I actually, you know, I saw you the it's other day like on the there, Nancy. You didn't say hi. I, I assume you just didn't see me. Uh Gerald, my God, Gerald! They're busy. Wow, look at all that out there. Wow, look at all that down there. Hey! What was that? Oh my god! That's an OSHA violation! That's an OSHA violation! Why do they let you animate it? I'd run everyone. My office, you gotta take the pipes to get to my office. Oh my god. Did you hear the crack? Feels like my car can't take much more. Why not use the public transport? Yeah, why not? Right next to a train station anyway, and there's a metro station south of the office. Say something. <laughs> I can't jump from that. <laughs> there's no way these railings are up to code. Really? Yeah. Alright, where the hell am I? Saves you a fair bit of money. Take the elevator? I'm thinking about I don't know what floor my office is on. How do I check? I don't know. Oh, sauna. What's Wait, we have a sauna? How long have, since when have we had a sauna? At the office? Oh my god. Oh my god. Look at this place. Wow, what's this here? NCG Sauna Evening Drink Contributors. The one who contributes the most will receive a raise. Uh, wow, Steve really, Steve and Carla really have been doing a lot. Mark, I don't really, uh... Chat, what the fuck? Only seven? There's like 2,000 people that work here in this office. Hey, you down there. How many fucking, how many drinks you contribute, jackass? Where the fuck did he go? I think he's behind like the l That guy, that guy right there, that guy right there. That guy right there. That guy right there. How many drinks this guy, can how many drinks does this guy contribute? How many drinks you, you contribute to- Guess I won't be coming to work soon. Feels like my car can't take much more. Why not use the- How many drinks you'll contribute to this? Right next to a train station anyway. There's a metro- I'm gonna land on this guy. <laughs> It's okay, chat. We don't die if we land on them. I'm gonna put this in my cringe compilation, dude. Hey. Hey. Why not use the public transport? I live right next to a train station. I got him. And there's a metro station south of the office. All right, let's go to the sauna. Let's get, let's get, chat. Let's enjoy ourselves before we have to go out to like the dam. Cause try here's the here's the real bullshit. The others, they all got sent to the nice parts of the abandoned city. Me, <laughs> chat. No OSHA worker has ever survived more than five minutes in the dam I'm getting sent to. None of them. Oh, this is the OSHA brand shampoo. Oh wow. Oh, eh. 
That's our special shampoo brand. This is the sauna. If this was my summer car, I'd piss all over this and just make like the worst thing ever, but it's not, so I don't have to do that. Toilets. No mirrors, because who would want to look at themselves? Grill, for when I'm grilling. Ah, how did I... What fucking floor am I on? Eight? Is this where my office is? Well... <laughs> here we go again, chat. Here we... Here we go again. <laughs> here we are! Floor 8 is where my office is. Right here. Damn, dude. A fucking smart toilet. Let's not worry about that. Accidentally broke the glass. Don't touch Carl. Carl, what the fuck? Good thing that's not my office. Fuck. I think this might be my office. God damn it. The printing room. Cannot. Hello? It's just up to code. I don't think you're supposed to be able to just walk in here. The engineer solves your problems. No bullshit. Make sure your body is ready at January 15th because this shit comes to theaters. All right. <laughs> Thanks for letting me know. You guys want some drinks? We got mocha cola, we got mocha cola light, we got splurt, we got fail, we got iced tea, and we got Septamax. You don't want anything with Septa in the name. That's like a drink. Is this my office? No. Is this one my office? No. Is this my office? No. Mark, where do you live? Is this my office? No. Fuck. Where the fuck is my office? This is why this game takes 30 hours, because I can't find my office. I think I passed it. It was the one with the broken fucking window. Huh? Hey! Hey, guys! Guys! Gerald! Gerald! Hope you're having a good day today! Someone, you can't do this. You just can't do this. You just can't do that. You just can't do that. Engineer Siltanen, when in doubt, just call me Mark. Here's my office. Someone misspelled this fucking poor bastard's name. John Hassan. Sad. Or maybe it was deliberate. I don't know. Die tart de tart. I feel like they misspelled Johnson. Anyways, welcome to my office. It's not as. No way. Is that just beer? You tell me I just got beer in the office? Just sitting there? I guess this ain't like. This ain't America. Alright, chat. So we know where we're going. The old dam. The old Hammer Valley Dam. No OSHA agent has ever survived going to the dam at Hammer Valley. Not one. Mark, before you go, take the following with you. A flashlight, a camera, a helmet. Last time you didn't, keys from reception. Boss. P.S. I left the company car keys below. And get new markers. These suck. They do suck. So where the hell's my helmet? All right, flashlight, helmet. Okay, that's everything. Gotta be safe. Now to grab the master keys from the reception. Thanks, boss. Boss gets it, dude. Let's get out of here. Let's get back down. Let's take the elevator. We'll get downstairs and we'll get started with our work. Fucking door. Gerald! Gerald! Oh, I had to unlock the door. All right. Fuck. <laughs> what the fuck? 
Okay. Where's that elevator at? <laughs> ah, hell yeah. Let's get out there. Let's get out there. It's time to shut down some expensive buildings. We'll take the stairs. I need to work out. <laughs> I need to work out. Let's roll. Look at how fast I am. I... Crap. Just when I wanted to do some cardio. Yes, I'll have to take the elevator. My guy sounds like the bad guy. You know, like, I don't want to be mean to the voice actor, but he sounds... This voice is the voice of a character that's evil. You know? You guys all have a good day today! Alright, you have a good day. I'm off to the dam. To kill dam. <laughs> you know? The dam. What's you up? All right there, Mark. What? You, you know, honestly, not really. I've had a kind of hard day lately, Henry. I'm glad you asked, because you know, up until now, I thought you were just ignoring me. I thought you were all just ignoring me. It means a lot to know that you actually realize I'm here. That I'm real, because honestly, it feels like the whole world just ignores me, ignores what I do. I'm going out to the Dam of Death today, the one that all the OSHA agents die at. I got assigned to the bad one. And I just, I just don't, I just don't know what I'm gonna do out there. You know, I was asked to take pictures, but I'm actually kind of scared. I'm afraid this might be one of my last moments, you know? You know? You know? Wait a minute. There's... There's Gerald, that just walked by. Hang on. Wait a minute. Everyone shut the fuck up. One last thing before we get out of here. have been nothing. <laughs> For a second I thought Gerald was gonna walk back out again. Like he's been walking in a big circle even though that's not physically possible with the layout of this place. You know what I mean? Like I... No, that's a different guy. Alright. <laughs> a different guy who looks like shit, by the way. Alright, let's get out of here. Nice outfit, jackass. Alright, let's ride. Oh. Alright, we got there. Alright. Floor one. Let's get out there. It's a nice ass building, I'm not gonna lie. We invested all of our money into this one. All of our money went into this one. You're gonna be able to tell in like 30 seconds when we get to the next building. And it's all shit. What the hell? Oh my god. Oh no. No, 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 no. Looks like someone forgot to pay the electricity bill. What the fuck? Help! Help! Someone please! Gerald! Ger I'm writing this up. You okay? I'm an engineer. Oh wait. The doors of all Romu lifts commercial elevators can be opened manually by overriding the fuses B2 and B3. How do I know which one is B2 and B3? Oh. Did that open quietly without me noticing? This whole time? Huh. I guess I'll have to take the stairs. I tried jumping again. I gotta be honest, I did. Uh, it's fine. We'll take the goddamn stairs. No problem. No problem. No problem. No one has to worry about anything. Let's just get to the company car and go on a little joyride. We've earned it. This is the... You know, when the boss said company car, I, uh... I really didn't think it would be like this. 
Also, I am sort of wondering, uh, there's something weird with the stairs that's kind of wigging me out, chat. Um, it's this, it's this wild thing where I don't think I've gone up more than one flight without someone blocking the entire staircase with chairs and boxes. Or locking it entirely. Meanwhile, the elevator just broke down. Technically, if I was on OSHA, I should really report all this. But I'm not gonna tell on myself. <laughs> Uh, Matt's not the company car. Shit. I forgot to grab the master keys for perception. God damn it. God fucking damn it. God damn it. God damn it. Fuck. Shit. Fuck. Fuck shit. Where the fuck even is reception? Where are they? <laughs> Uh, wait, communism? Oh, wait, communots. For a second, I thought we were communists. You know, that's wild. Woo! That would have been scary, you know what I mean? Mark, you have a letter from the city authority. It's on the counter. Don't worry, it's not a parking ticket. Oh my god. Like it's just some keys. Stop looking at me like that. Wendy Jesus. Feeling all right there, Mark? Wendy, you look so tired. <laughs> Are you okay? I... Thanks. You look tired, Wendy. You good? I just wanted to check my mail, but I guess I can't. Seriously? What's up with the doors? Why can't I leave? Get someone from maintenance to take a look. Didn't you leave your car in the parking garage downstairs anyway? Wendy, we are literally OSHA. We cannot have the front doors not open. This is un this is actually so bad. We're trapped inside the building. Sometimes it Guys, don't get sidetracked. We are talking about elevators here. Hey guys, speaking of elevators, have I got some news. I had to literally use my engineering skills to crack open the elevator door after it seized up on floor six. I actually think I heard the emergency brake starting to lift off <laughs> right as I got the door open in our own building. Do you happen to know anything about that, Paul? Nothing more to say, huh? The more to say about the elevators in the building? I'm writing all this down. Yeah. God, fuck these doors. God, fuck you, damn it. We're not, if we're not here, consider the following. Is the power cable really plugged in? I'm going to unplug every server in this building. Why don't I have clearance for this? I'm an engineer. A pack of spare batteries for the camera. I'm stealing batteries, baby. You know I'm stealing batteries, baby. What's this? Well, congratulations, you finally managed to show up to work instead of playing Mahi's Mato 3D or whatever. But guess what? Our servers got hacked and you've and you're exactly the person we need right now. I don't know if we're still being hacked, but I needed to start fixing this right away. I'm already out to my neck. And these redundant complaints from everyone in the building, so I really need your help. Damn. Uh, this building's uh, literally falling apart. Why the hell do they have a hacksaw in here? I should talk to the boss about that. But I'm currently lost inside the building. Where the fuck am I? Oh. This is the emergency exit. <laughs> well, I tried. Nancy, every door in the building is locked. We're trapped in here. Don't look away from- look at me when I'm talking to you. 
Stop. Feeling all right there, Mark? No, I'm not, as a matter of fact. But I guess I'll just leave and leave you all to your fates. Goodbye. And they're gonna die. Chat. They're all gonna die, chat. Every last one of them's gonna die inside of a horrible fire hazard. Where's my car? Now, where is the car? I'm just gonna start opening doors until I find it. There it is. Oh my god. Company standard issue. <laughs> this bad boy gets two miles to the gallon. <laughs> Smells like freedom. <clears throat> Let's get the hell out there. It's time to file some vehicle complaints and OSHA complaints. Every complaint in the book. It's time to complain professionally. And it's a beautiful day in Salberg today, with a little over 18 degrees Celsius and slight overcast. Salberg. Yeah, I'm kind of a professional whiner. Here we are! The amount of OSHA agents that have fucking died on this path. R.I.P. Just another day, no fishing. I'll call my boss and let him know I'm here. I'm not answering that. I'm finally here. Never mind, I'm answering. The traffic was horrible. Any last minute tips before I start surveying this place? You know the trail. Take pictures of everything that's broken. How do I take my phone, my camera out? If you come across any technical documents or other documents of interest, take pictures of them. It'll help our cause. Okay, bye. Okay. Bye. The focus indicator on the camera screen changes when looking at something that can be photographed. Yeah, but what if I just want to take a lovely photo of, like, a bird, you know? Well, let's take a look around, chat. First of all, what the fuck is this? What is this? An electrical line that I can touch with my fucking forehead. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, I'll tell you one thing that I had to go in already. Ah. Uh, not this. All right, that's not up to code at all. Putting that down. Oh, yeah. Yep. Yeah, that's going in. This right here. Going in my cr this is going in my OSHA uh, violation cringe compilation. Oh yeah, that's going in the list. Fire hazard. I'm not surprised. I could bite this with my goddamn teeth. And oh, and there's gas next to the goddamn is that bomb? Corrosive acid. Click. The goddamn, the drain is all jammed up with sticks and rocks. That's not good. That's not good. That's not good. And this side is all jammed up with, uh, like, a fucking slab of, of, of like, st fucking wood. Someone should get that. Someone should get that fixed if they don't want a fucking fine on their hands. Oh, my God. This place, when will they learn? When will they learn, chat? That's the thing. <laughs> I'm alive! I'm alive! I'm alive! I'm alive! Everything's fine. I'm alive! I'm alive! I'm alive! I'm alive! I'm alive! <laughs> Someone's got to learn, but it ain't gonna be me. It never happened. It never happened. Why does this game let you jump off railings? Because maybe one day they'll be—it'll be important. You know? Someone didn't. That's a violation. That they didn't even like pad they, the person that locked this fucking padlock didn't actually put it through anything. That's a violation. I'm putting that in the violations. <laughs> All right. First inspection target. That's a violation. An old power plant that I already forgot the name of. Let's see how this place is doing. <laughs> no fire extinguishers for miles. That's a safety hazard. 
can't see a fire extinguisher anywhere. <sighs> smell that chat. Get your nose up in the air. Really smell it. Go on, go ahead. Don't worry, it's safe. Get a smell in. Get a real smell. Get a smell. You smell that? Smell that? It's black mold and asbestos. If you breathe it in for more than 30 seconds, you're already dead. Oh. oh my god. That's vile. What is this? Someone named JK was doing a real bad job with the maintenance. Heart aching again, gotta take it slow. Let's see, in 2003 he came by and said, I know I visited the shithole on a date like that. To know I visited this shit hold on a date like that is actually kind of sad. You tell me this guy went on a date with someone? Goddamn heart. Well, at least this place is still intact after all this time. I don't feel the same. Damn. 2000. What is this, a bottle? This guy's been drinking on the job? What is this? Broken glass? On the fucking, like, pathway? That's an OSHA violation. That's going in the list. That's going in the list. That's going in the list. That's going in the list, dude! Uh, let's see here. The, uh, get, looks like the, um, entire dam is currently flooding. I'm pretty sure it's not to Yeah, there's that. not supposed to be steam all over the fucking thing that's going on the list. Can't fucking see anything in here. No lights. It's going on the list. <laughs> so, chat, how, how, how you reckon their bill's gonna be so far? Because I'm about to say high. Like, very high. Bolt cutters. Bolt cutters. Might come in handy. Will come in handy. Batteries. A pack of spear batteries for the flashlight. Oh, yeah. This is. Do something. Stop that. Well, let's get down there. Let's get down there and take a look around. There's something off about this place. Shoe? Lone shoe down here. That's, uh, that's not the code. Hang on, this thing has a battery amount. I can't just take pictures really nilly, I don't think. I think I have to actually, like, be careful what I take pictures of. That makes two packs of spears for the camera. Never mind. I thought I was locked in for a second. I thought like a ghost appeared. Well. All right, here we are. This is where the dam comes out. Let's see how dangerous it is on this side. I get an angle like this. Let's see here. Power lines at the proper elevation. Trees, beautiful and scenic. Fuck. I'm alive. I'm fine. Everything's fine. No one panic. But good news is there's nothing more to take a picture of right now. We don't have to worry about it. We've done everything we can in that area. But uh, overall, I'm going to say this dam has to close. I don't think they can be allowed to function anymore, chat. I think the final rating I'm going to give that dam on my OSHA rating list is BIG FAIL in all caps. The pH of the water is good. I don't care about the pH. What the fuck? Is that a makeshift Resident Evil, like, like a Resident Evil puzzle, like, boat that you have to get, like, a... S that thing just short out and explode. Oh, uh, when I got here? That's like, chat, that's like a boat that you see, well, I guess Ethan Winters, he walks up and says, I don't understand how to make this work, and it's got, like, a fancy, like, emblem in it where it fits, like, a squirrel. Like, a squirrel-shaped, like, mold. And then when you put it in, the boat suddenly works. And it takes you to the other side. That is a violation. Oh no, I'm slipping. <laughs> the paths don't, they, they don't accommodate me. Hang on, I gotta get that in. This just exploded. Someone should get that fixed. Yeah, someone should get that fixed. Only one pack of batteries left. I don't even know what the fuck this is supposed to be.
This is unbelievable. Someone's getting fired for this. I don't know who it is, but they're getting fired for that. I don't know who. It's a good thing. Thank God I haven't died yet. You know what I mean? I don't even... What the fuck is this? That's right next to the goddamn river! That's not good. Kids scamper around in the water just by that bridge! They scamper, they play in the water, they splash each other with the fucking damn water! And you're telling me any second now we're gonna fry them? Papa, Papa, please let me play in the water, Papa! Look at this! That's bad. That's bad. That's bad. Hey, I mean, hey! They got one of those. <laughs> Chat, they got one of those. Now, uh, I am gonna have to say there's a couple parts of this bridge that have fucking holes in it. That's not the code. That, they're gonna have to fix this up, because, like, look at this. I'm walking along the bridge right now. Oh! Oh, my leg! Ah! And then I'm dead. Just like that. Did you see? It happened just like that. I'd get my leg and my ankle stuck inside the wood, and then I, my leg would snap off, and then I'd fall into the water. And then I'd be electrocuted by the water, by the electrocuted water, you know? There's only one life, like, life floaty. That's what they're called. This doesn't seem, f like, safe. They should fence this off. That's not good. I got a picture of it that time while it was zapping. It's just so everyone knows that I got it right. I got it perfect that time. I wanted to do it again so I could get it properly. Look at that fucking ugly ass bridge. Someone should get that fixed. Ramla, take this. No, grab this. Grab the chainsaw. Hello? Guys, you have to be careful. I draw my knife, I draw a switchblade out of my fucking pocket. I start spinning it around. <laughs> You gotta be careful in a place like this. There's squatters everywhere. I run around the corner. I stab wildly. Nothing. That's three packs of camera batteries. Good. What do we got here? I can't fucking read this. It's too dark. Hang on. No, nope, still can't read it. Okay, we're gonna have to squint here because this is fucking dark. Matt. Do you know why the dam stopped passing our logs through the chute? It's been weeks since the last log passed through it. I tried contacting the people at the dam to get this sorted out, but there's no one there. Yesterday we tried pushing the logs into the log tunnel, but the chute seems to be blocked from inside. Any idea what's going on over there? Also, I still have yet to receive payment for the... B... For the... B... Uh... B-Y-S... Buys? Is that a B? Is that that's a BYS, right? Or is that logs? I guess that's logs. That's so fucking hard to see, chat. Like it's actually invisible to me. I'm seeing the outlines of letters at this point at the bottom. We sent you months ago, Tom. This one I can read better. Dear Tom, I know about the hyper hi, the hydropower company's sudden bankruptcy, but I've seen Alex Hart the Hartman occasionally entering the power plant. And light coming out of the windows of the dam at night. As for the log payments, I'm still waiting for the funding from our client. I'm expecting to receive... Is that illegal OSHA? Like, circumventing OSHA? Like, log transactions? Not on my watch. I'm taking a picture of this. A local logging company. Looks like they went out of business. Yes, they should. Only two packs left. Yes. As they should. Illegal. They didn't have clearance for that vile. Filthy, filthy monsters! What is this? What the fuck is liquid gypsum? In case of accident, deny all existence of this chemical in contaminated area! <laughs> That's going in the log. Hey, Unreal Tick Gaming, thanks for the five gifted subs. Dude, that's like super not up to code. You're supposed to hide the boxes around corners where people can't see them.
You might actually be right in people dying here. Dude, chat, my, I can barely breathe already. You actually are supposed to play this game with smell -O vision and you get a special package in the mail before you play it, which was really weird because it had a bunch of wrapping all over it. That I didn't I didn't understand at first. But it's really hard to breathe with the nose thing, the nose harness on. Like I keep <laughs> I keep I, it's hard to breathe like this lately. It's hard to breathe with something wrong. Hang on, let's check the toilet. This is really important. This doesn't even- there's no- there's no latch on this. That's going in the fucking compilation. We'll just keep moving. So up here we may see the bodies of dead children that were electrocuted by the, uh, faulty wiring up towards the dam. You guys should all be ready for that. Many people have fucking died here. Many. Many, many, many. Too many. Even. Mm. Hope they don't still send trains through here, because these tracks don't work. These tracks are all full of holes. We, uh, we actually cut a lot of corners when they were building these. Uh, these tracks don't work. Uh, what do we got here? That should do it. What did I just do? Oh! I set it to red. Which means stop. Wait. What's the difference, though? Stop. Help me. Huh! Damn, dude, I almost died. You are not supposed to be on this train track, though. That's like... See, now it's safe to go because there's no way there's another train coming. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah, no, that's why this place ain't OSHA code. Yeah, it's exactly stuff like that that makes this place not safe. Like, we didn't even finish that tunnel. We didn't even bother. You're just not supposed to go in there. That should do You're just not supposed to go in there. <laughs> Mo the majority of the places... Did I not turn this off? They'll stop, because it says stop. STOP! By order of the law, I command you to- Okay. Thanks. But that is a violation. I don't even know if a train should be in that tunnel. But they shouldn't be. They sure as shit shouldn't be. I don't think anyone's supposed to be, like, this tr This train track isn't upkept. I don't even think there's a person in that train. That might just be automated. Is that a f fucking bullet hole in the window? Whose fucking train is this? What is this? I do not have time to unpack whatever's going on here. I think I leave. You know? Mm -hmm. I don't even know why I had to stop that train. That guy's never gonna leave. Blocked train track? Actually, not my problem, believe it or not. That part's not my problem. I have nothing to do with that. I actually have no say in that. Breaking into people's houses, though. <laughs> That is my problem. I'm going in. Can't remember to do that. Uh, is the septic tank empty? Can't go in it to check. Whoever lived here, they left in a hurry. That's three packs of camera batteries. Can't take any pictures of any of this stuff. Hello? Anyone in there? Is there anyone in there? Hello? Hello? Uh, well, nothing here is actually part of my, like, examination. I don't actually have to do anything here. This isn't part of my job. So I think I'm allowed to just go. Yeah, none of this is my problem. We can just leave. 
I was passing through like a random town. These wires seem to give me the creeps. I don't know, something about them wiggling around like that can't be safe. There's something off about this place, chat. You know, something wrong. Something strange about this place. I'm worried in a second now, like I'm gonna get like, a, a rock's gonna fall on me or something. You know what I mean? What the hell? Oh! Well, what the fuck was that sound? Did somebody just shoot a gun at me? I don't want any trouble. I, I just don't want any trouble. Ah. Uh, boat. Uh, nothing wrong with the boat, which is good. Yep, up to code on the boat. No problems there. We'll head back across now. Nope. 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 I don't see a more line. <laughs> Nerd. What are you, some kind of dork? Look at the ray tracing on this, uh... I'm dead. I died. I died. I died. I died. Hey, what's this? Uh... Are troll hulls, like, part of OSHA's, uh, systems? Do we care about this? Do we care about this? Uh... Oh, wow! Yeah, that's not safe. I gotta document this. This is going- this is going right in the book chat. This is- This one's going right in the fucking scrapbook, dude. Hello? 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 Is anyone, uh... Is anyone able to hear me in here? I'm with OSHA? I'm, um, trying to get pictures for my job to show this place at. Oh, yep. You got mushrooms. These things are incredibly poisonous. You just cannot have those. These things. Only two packs left. These things will kill you if you even get near them. Oh, what's this? Geocache. A geocache. All right, well. There isn't anything inside it. Wow, jackasses. You tell me whoever got that geocache just looted it and like left without putting anything else in it? Isn't that like like Only illegal? One of batteries left. Isn't that like illegal? This game feels like a darker version of Firewatch. Yeah, I mean if like every time you turn a corner and another environmental hazard happened because it's all none of this is to code. None of this is legal. Did he steal the cash? What a twat. Yeah, well, whatever, dude. I'm Osha. What are you gonna do? Tell on me? You want me to look at like the structural integrity of your like deck and tell on you? I'm going back this way since it all loops. Is that a GeoGuessr reference? Keck W, I'm 12, by the way. Oh boy. Mm -mm -mm. You can tell this is the end of the map because the trees stop having detail. Imagine thinking you're stronger than OSHA. I know, right? Uh. Yeah, this one's going in. Yeah. I wonder how. Yeah, that's going in. That's going in the, the report. We have some fucking assholes by the dam have, like, bombs from, like, the Cold War sitting around there. Fuck, I'm gonna kick it. Hang on. would really blow up is all I was like <laughs> thinking it would be a funny thing deserved I didn't deserve that shut up I'm not gonna go get that geocache again I don't really care about it 
I think they're like just collectibles. Well, nothing here is not to code, I don't think. I think everything here is fine. Uh, let me check over. I don't think I can get in here either, unless I jump the fence, which would be insane. So I think it's time we double. We got double back to ta like the dam. We got double back to the dam. This is still wild. This should not be here. But whatever. Let's go this way. This is like our actual destination. That was like a side thing. This is the actual dam now. We're here. Now, if there's going to be violations, it's going to be in here. This is where... Uh, we can't open it. Wait, did I just... Oh, I guess I opened it. Well, here we are, chat. Hammer Valley Dam. Oh, it zooms when I move my face closer to the camera, too. That's cool. Hammer Valley Dam. Over Hammer 40... Valley Dam. I hope that at least this place is in a better condition. 40 different OSHA agents have freaking gotten their whole bodies destroyed by asbestos in this place. Most of them are just coughing up pure asbestos after a while. It's almost all asbestos top to bottom. It's all poison. We best keep our wits about us if we don't want to die like them. Yeah. Best keep our wits wits about us if we don't want to. Yeah. Now we can turn on the engine to the dam. Remember, Chad, we're also an engineer, and that means we have to do repair work. Can I crawl in the dam? Uh, kind of. Fuck. I need a way to turn on the... Okay, I found it. There we go. Power on! All right, this dam's uh, cooking. Nice. This dam's cooking with gas, chat. <sighs> Hell yeah, this thing's purring like a... purring like a normal cat, essentially. The only problem I see here is... <laughs> There's no goddamn fire hydrants. Or fire extinguishers. Nothing to prevent a fire. Crack? Wait, was there a giant crack? Hang on, go back up! Go back up! Up, 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 up! Go back up! <laughs> go back up! Don't send me into the crack! Send... Oh... Oh, no... You suck at your fucking job, chat. I have no- I have- I, I'm coughing and asbestos dust is coming out of my mouth. All right? I'm getting a call. I have reception down here. It's me. I just came from the old power plant. I don't think anyone's been there for years. One of the generators was broken. Did you find anything else? A tree had fallen on the train tracks. Mm -hmm. I managed to change the signal just in time. You should inform the railroad guys to have someone clean up the track. Anyway. After I am down at the dam, I'm heading to survey the Bergman Tunnels. Could you have someone pick up my car? The Bergman Tunnels? Keep me posted. The tunnels? I don't want to go in the tunnels. They got crazy- they got crazy cannibals in the tunnels. I don't want to go near the tunnels. Oh, and there is a bomb! Uh-oh, uh uh-oh. Uh, oh, this is a violation. Shit. Oh, shit! Oh, Jesus Christ! It's a violation. That's- a, I'm writing that down. I could have died. It's a violation. It's a violation. It's going right inside the fucking dot. Like, you can stop corruption. Smoking on the job. What's all this? Mm -hmm. Cover that once I take a look around. Ah, yes, I see. Where the hell am I, though? But where am I? Hartman's office. It's not this door. Yeah, this all makes sense to me. Yeah. Yeah. Fixed it. Here we are. Oh, for a second I thought all those were gonna work. 
and I was gonna start screaming and screeching and just having like a bad time. Uh, is this uh, wall actively warping or is that just rock? The lab, the lab. The electrician linked the lock of this door with the main fuse of the lab. This will be fixed soon. Why the fuck would I want to go in there? I don't want to go in the lab. I need to get a picture of the crack on the dam that everyone was just screeching about. Yikes. Yeah. The dam's in even worse condition than I thought. Yeah. Yeah, people live down here. That's bad. That's really bad. That's like a huge crack. But you know what? The rest of the dam, though. Pretty much mint condition, chat. Pretty much mint condition on the rest of the dam. Not seeing any problems here other than some, uh, some cans. And, uh, that's, um, some kind of fungus. You're not supposed- believe it or not, you're not supposed to have fungus in the dam. But we can just pour some glue on that and that'll fix itself right up. That's like a gluing situation. Uh, yeah, the fucking... Yeah, it's locked. Can't even get in there. No entry. Take a picture of that. No entry sign opening. Uh, that's important, I would say. Uh... I shouldn't be able to enter, but yet I did. Only one pack of batteries left. <sighs> oh! Danger, high voltage, main switch, SBS. What the fuck? My guy's not strong enough to move all these down. Are these on or off? My guy's not that strong. Doors, machinery, I need the lab hatch. I'm locked in here. Oh, I, I bet I can just leave. No, I'm locked in here. Help, 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 help. I can't get out of the door. This isn't a code! It's fine, right? everyone calm down. Everyone just calm the hell down. No one's ever gotten... There was keys. There were keys. There were keys. Why am I hearing... I'm still hearing the sound of electrical feedback. Which is like... I don't know. Loudest water of the year. Probably not safe. I don't feel like you should be hearing like the sound of electricity coursing all the time everywhere. But I believe I cut the power, which means we should not hear any more of that. Have I gotten any texts? <laughs> no. The answer was no. I turned on the generators, chat. Look. This place is safer than ever. Get a load of this. This place is getting shut the fuck down. I'm shutting this place the hell down. Hey, chat. You think, the, you think the fucking owner of this dam is gonna freaking cry when I walk up to him and tell him his dam's closed forever? Because it's, uh, lightning? It's mostly lightning? You think he's gonna, like, go, like, ee! He's gonna fucking cry? Like a little baby? When I tell him his dam's closed on account of it being all lightning? I can't wait. I'm looking forward to it. I'm looking forward to when he starts crying. Like a wee little baby. Right, cut the power. 
I think damn is the appropriate response. Damn! Oh, I see. Must be careful not to go too deep. Why, am I gonna drown? He fucking drowned. You're telling me this guy. The water is electrified. I better watch my step. Alright. Let me just do a rewind on that one. What are you doing? I didn't see any lightning on the shallow water, so I was just wondering if maybe, like, source fuckery. You know what I mean? Because it's on source. So I was like, hmm, maybe. I guess I won't go the uh, deep way. I'll go the shallow way. Let's build ourselves a fun little snaking, like, uh, box ride. Well, this isn't on water here, so I can skip this. We barely need any of these boxes because we can just use, uh... Must be careful not to go too... Yeah, I know, man. You're scared of water. Am I going to have to fuck with anything there? I don't think so. All right, let's activate the, the lightning. Actually, let me make... Why am I even doing this? Wait, I have a good question for myself. Why do I care about doing this like this? What am I doing? Maybe to open that door. Maybe to open this door. Maybe to leave. I mean, I feel like I'm gonna have to backtrack at the same time and like do some fuckery with like the levers again. Remember those notches, all those switches? I don't think I did those right. I kind of just did them all over. I didn't really like consciously choose any specific ways to send it. So uh, I think I'm gonna turn this corner and look over there at this, at like the, the green and realize that the things I want to go into are not open. But let's see. Yeah, there's no power in fucking any of those. I need to go upstairs. There's no, there's no OSHA. There's no, there's no way OSHA's getting in there. Now, which one of these is the de All right, turbine hall. Enabled. Everything in turbine hall is now on. No problem. Let's roll. Bada bing, see that? We can get in there now, let's go. The water is electrified. Yeah, shut the fuck up. Bud, are you made out of paper and toothpicks? My guy. And the reason I keep dying is because this place just ain't so cold. I better watch my step. Me, 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 me. Watch me speed run. All right. Here we are. It's exactly where I wanted to be. The control room. High voltage. Don't touch this. Don't touch any of this. Damn, dude, this looks like a place where I'm gonna get, like, a fucking radiation reading. Well, 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 Alex Hartman, CEO of Valley, Hammer Valley Hydro. Alright, yeah, press it. What have I done? Wait, that was a big mistake. Alex! Alex! My name is Alex Hartman. I was just betrayed by the man who practically built this whole city. What? <laughs> it started with Bergman. Huh? Stahlberg Steel. And now, my company. Huh? All bankrupted by Jeff Walter. Jeff Walter? They bought the companies for next to nothing and then ran them straight into the ground. But that's the least of my problems. With the company out of business, there's no way we can keep everything in good repair. Things are breaking down all over the city, but no one's Oh my freaking god, that's a violation. Police, the mayor, and now it seems like even the governor's in his pocket. My god. They care more about his money than what he's doing to this place. Whatever he's planning, it's going to happen. And I don't want to be here when it does. 
Sounds like work. There's one thing I'm sure of. Everything's about to fall apart. Sounds like the one thing this goddamn city needs is an OSHA agent with too much free time on his hands. I can do that. I can be the hero this city needs and deserves. Literally Seattle. Says a chat member. Fucking turn on already! <laughs> Open all the way! Open all the way! Open to maximum power! Turn on! Turn on! Open all the sluice, dude! Fucking finally on! Open it, open all the sluice, man. Open the whole sluice. Open the whole sluice. I don't care. Open the sluice. Look at that generator purr, dude. Look at that. Fully opened. Listen to that. Listen to that generator. Activate. How you doing down there? Looks like the water's flowing lovely, lovely, lovely. Let's kick this thing into maximum overdrive! We got more buttons to press, that's the problem. Something's wrong with the lag synchroscope. We're gonna need to push more levers and pulleys. Alright, Chad, let's take a look around. Oh, yeah. Spooky hallway? That ain't code, baby. Why? <laughs> that ain't code at all. What is this? What is all this? This whole freaking hallway done caved in. This leads to the caves. We don't go that way. Not after what happened. Not after the accident. And this leads to the offices. What the fuck? Oh. That's three packs of camera batteries. Love batteries. A nice coffee machine. It's a nice coffee machine. Only two packs left. Some like spooky hallways. You guys think I'm gonna see the ghost of capitalism somewhere around here? Fuck. No, it feels like this place is lived in by someone. I don't know. Things. Fuck. There's nothing in there. Stuff. Schematics. Don't need those. Let's go into the stuff drawer. Wait, there's something in the stuff drawer. Wait, what? This is my final day working here. After the financial problems started stacking for the company, Hartman started becoming more and more stressed and unstable. The more unstable he grew, the more he failed coming up with solutions to save the company from its debts. Instead, he kept blaming Walter for everything, especially after he was forced to sell his company. After the loss of his wife, Hartman started recording hateful messages to Walter, craving for vengeance. This is my testimony for any future investigations of these events. Soon to be ex-secretary, Caitlin. Okay. Alright, Caitlin, I don't remember asking. But let me check the file section. Nothing. Wait, should I document this? This is like actual evidence to like a crime. <laughs> Hang on, let me write this down. Intrigue. That's like actual evidence to like a crime. I actually have to document that. Fuck, it's locked. I didn't unlock this door. Fucked up big time. Yeah, yeah, it's like I just didn't ask, like, is the thing, you know? Chair. This guy was really obsessed with Jeff Walter. Oh, wait, wait, yeah, this guy had like a whole fucking sign for it, dude. Walter, this is my Jeff Walter map. This is how I keep track of what Jeff Walter's deal is. I freaking hate that guy, asshole. He look at all the things he does. I fucking do not like Jeff Walter or his goddamn bullshit. It pisses me off. I like cigars. I'm a cigar guy. 
Yeah, I broke that. What of it? You gonna call the police? Yeah, I broke that cup. You gonna tell on me? You gonna tell on me to the police or something? I gotta open that door over here. I forgot. I fucked it. I fucked up. Alright, let's see what's past this place. Let's see if we can see what the problem is with this goddamn dam. Let's get a good look at this goddamn thing. Let's take a look. Alright, so if you see there, you can still see the giant fucking crack. Dude, and we pretty much anything. If like a bird lands on the top of that dam, this whole thing's gonna come crashing to the ground and destroy Mima's house. Pretty much instantly. <laughs> honestly, honestly, I'm pretty excited for it. Electrical doohickeys. You know you don't like seeing electrical doohickeys expo expo exposed to like the air. That's just not good. It's not good. Big puddles. Don't like to see it. Grass? Don't like to see it. What is all this? Remember, synchronization. There are two synchroscopes in the control room. Use them before you do this. I'd like to see you make me, pussy. Oh, I think it's making me. We gotta power the dam up, or we can't get out of here. Oh wait, yes we can. Alright, I got out. Powering up the dam is just a bunch of bullshit. You don't actually have to in order to finish the level. You can just leave. You can just leave! Just walk right out of there! Wait, I don't think I can. Hello! Does anyone live here? You should be aware that if you don't evacuate soon, a big fucking dam's gonna fall on you and crush you and kill you. Hello? 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 Talberg Times, Hammer Valley Hydro files for bankruptcy. No wonder there were problems getting logs through. Whole place closed down. This city's finished. This town's finished, Chad. Saw one big mess, and no one's been in here since 1982. Which means this place is only up to OSHA standards from the funicular, funicular. Dude, it's got fun in the name. There's no power. Wait, yes there is. Dude, yeah, why the hell would I ever, like, use the goddamn dam when I could just leave? I've done all I can. My final rating for the dam is, damn! <laughs> we have to close it. Anyways. Am I gonna die? Wait, am I gonna die? Shit. Ah! What's wrong? Why'd that happen? That wasn't fun. I think I have to power up the dam. I think something broke the funicular. Funicular. Yeah, it's gonna be an OSHA violation in the half. Almost died on the fun thing. Wait until you hear about this. All right, chat. Let's go figure out why the fucking dam isn't on. All right, let's fix this. Let's get to the goddamn bottom of this. Someone's got to fix this. Even if it requires flooding this entire valley with river water, I will. If that's what it takes. <laughs> if that's what it takes, goddammit, I'll do whatever, I'll do whatever I have to. This place ain't up to code. 
Anyways. So how the hell do I turn this place on? Button doesn't do anything. This generator doesn't turn on when I switch it. Nor does this one. Now when I check the sluice gate... It says it's sluicing. Make sure RPM is exactly 3,000 on both generators for activating them. Oh, fuck you, dude. Fuck you. Fuck you, man. Fine. 3,000 perfect. 3,000 perfect. Hit it. Ah! Oh, Jesus! Degenerating? How do I know if, uh... This is all working. I hope this doesn't kill me. Okay. We gotta synchronize this thing. Are these synced? Ah, uh, looks like I magically did it perfectly. Uh, I think I did it right by accident. I think that was supposed to be like a puzzle or like a timing thing. Well, I guess I fixed um, the entire dam. Oops. Uh, hey, Jet. You know what it is to code? My ability to handle any situation thrown at me. I'm in my element. My OSHA instincts have kicked in, <laughs> and I'm getting the hell out of here. Well, come on. Maybe, maybe you take one last picture of the dam before you go. How about that? I hand you the camera. How, how about you take one last picture of that dam? Before we get out of here, huh, kiddo? I shove you into the water. Yeah! You go, you go floating down the water. Yeah! You're just getting, you're getting uh, taken away. Sorry, kid. There ain't enough space in the funicular for two of us. You'll understand. That should do it. Don't know what I did, but I did it. <laughs> Don't know what I did, but I did it. And now, there's no way the funicular doesn't work perfectly in one try. Here we go, chat. Boss? Boss? Yeah, I did it. Hey, so I finished surveying the dam. It was in pretty bad shape. The generator room's flooded. And there's a huge crack in the side of the dam. Huh. Good thing that the place was on our list. Yeah. Also, the dam wasn't even connected to the grid anymore. I managed to reconnect it there. Wait, what? Wait. So you connected the flooded dam to the grid? Yeah, that is psycho, is that isn't it? Such a good idea? I don't see why not. I see why not! Anyway, I'm heading on to survey the Hey, dude. Hey, good news is... Right. Think about how many bitcoins can be mined off yeah. the power that dam produces, you know? And how many, how much NFT power can be, you know, allocated now. Imagine, think about how many more NFTs are on the market now because of what I did out there. At least two. A whole NFT is running off of that flooded dam. Why is this not working? This isn't fun. <laughs> you broke it! Shut the hell up! Shut up! Now! Obviously, I just missed something. I'll figure it out. I just need some time. I just need some goddamn time. There's gotta be something in this spooky abandoned sawmill that'll get that funicular back up and running. That makes two packs of ah! Ah! <laughs> We're gonna have to survive off these bottles. I can't reach it with my tongue. This ain't OSHA. I'm stuck. I'm actually stuck. I'm really stuck. I'm stuck. Help. Call, I gotta call the police. I'm calling the police. All right, we're back here. That's fine. But we'll have to listen to the guy make the call again. 
Note to self, don't close myself in a locker. Hey, so I finished serving Mom! with them. It's Get Mom! <laughs> Get mom, it's spots. bad! Get mom! There's a huge crack in the side of the door. Huh. Good thing that the place was on our list. Yeah. Also, the dam wasn't even connected to the grid anymore. I managed to reconnect it, though. I need to open the door Wait, so I can get back in. So you connected the flooded dam to the grid? I need to is make sure this is open. A good idea? I help! Mom, help! I'm scared! Anyway, I'm heading on to survey the Berman tunnels next. All right. Let me know once you're done there. Time to find a secret. Yeah. Finding secrets. Wait, what the hell is this? I found a key. A very small, almost impossible to see unless I was mashing like E key. So good thing I mash E on everything. Who like who who needs that? No one. Instructions. I can't freaking read that. So this is where I swim, right? The rest of the way. What's the point of this? What's the point of this balcony? Computers are old notes. Take loan for toll and taxes done. Send half million dollars done. Send timber shipment done. Receive money. Pay logs. Pay debts. Uh, something about a, a lumber deal. Some social security numbers and money. Just a bunch of crap to worry about later. Looks like they never received payment for their loan. They never got paid. What is this spider web? This is some, uh, this spider sucks. I don't get it. They aren't, they aren't, they don't get it at all. How do I get the funicular work? How do I, excuse me. <laughs> uh, hi, OSHA worker here, trying to figure out where the fun is, because <laughs> I'm not seeing any anywhere. And... <laughs> Well, that's not epic. Wait a minute, it's water! That's water! The electrical room is full of water. And now my fucking flashlight on. Of course. Should have known. I should have known there was something wrong with this place. It's not up to code. Like so many other parts is. Goddamn building. It's fine. So they want to kill me. What do I care? That's going in the f fucking catalog. Just one more goddamn thing on the list. I saw that a mile away. Can't open this door. It's freaking locked. Can't go that way. I'll have to climb these fucking boxes. What the fuck is this? Someone's gonna like fucking slip and die in this crap. They're gonna go like, oh, ah, and then they're gonna drown. Just like that. Don't you see? They're gonna go, oh, oh, and then they're gonna fall. And then you got more of these fucking poison mushrooms. Can't eat those. Don't eat them. There's a geocache up here. A hundred bucks is a geocache. Wait, what is the... The keys to the cave can be requested from the forest guard's cottage. Where the fuck is he at? Probably at the top of the vernacular. Which... <laughs> I'm not allowed up there. I can't actually go in the vernacular. Oh, no. This is... Uh, <sighs> I meant to do that because now I fast travel this way. Now I fast travel to this side. What is that building? Well, hey, at least we're gonna get a nice view of the dam from it. No, <gasps> chat. That's a. That's a. That's a gold-tailed. Uh, booby. You know them. That's a, that bird's been extinct for 40 years. 
Because humans hunted them down and killed them all, they... Wow. Humans hunted them down and killed them all because Only they, uh, they pick up babies backwards. and they throw them off of, like, high buildings. They, they, they grab babies by, like, their clothing and they huck them off of, like, five-story or higher buildings. They find it funny. They laugh. They actually laugh. They go like, ha, 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 when they do it, like sickos. So we hunted, we naturally hunted them to extinction. Oh, never mind. That was just the three-toed woodpecker. Also, this is a fucking violation. Yep, adding that to the goddamn list. I'm not surprised. What if someone broke their freaking leg? And then they got stuck here. And then a blue-footed, like, booby or something ran up and, like, ripped your face off because you couldn't fight back. That's an OSHA violation. Not gonna get me with that one. There's a fucking geocache back here. There's a goddamn geocache back here. There's no, I don't even have to walk up this thing to know it's a violation. Something about this building is violating something. Mm -mm -mm, mm -mm -mm. Now that's gonna be a $500 fine to the fucking animal that lives in this building. The poor bastard that lives here is gonna have a real bad fucking letter in the mail. I'm not, I don't play around. Mm -mm -mm. Those are poisonous mushrooms. You eat those and you die. You just die. Hello, it's me. The OSHA. Um, I would like it if you would let me inside. Okay, I'm coming in. Hello? 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 It's me, I work for OSHA. I need you to open the door and let me in. I'm coming inside. You got bats living in your attic. You might want to call someone about that. There's shit and piss everywhere. You gotta get someone about that. It's all kinds of toxic. <coughs> oh, no, no one's one lived here. paid for a while. That's for sure. All right. Well, then anything in here is mine now. Which is to say nothing. Something about this is a violation! Or not. Well, we got the key to the cave and the sawmill. Guard log, some random tourist was lost in the woods, took seven hours to find him. Seven hours spent the night kicking drunk teens out of the premises. Oh great, the HVH dam will be closed permanently in one week. Just bought lots of beer, this will be a good day. Nice. I'm happy for that guy. His bed is so vile. All right, anyways, let's get back to the vernacular chat. Stuff's about to get crazy for us. We're gonna go to the cave in a second. But maybe we'll try to get the the vernacular to work again. That'd be fun. I don't think it's gonna though. I think I think I don't think we're supposed to take the vernacular because I remember the guy talking about uh, going to the tunnels next, and that cave sounds like the tunnel. I think we're going into the goblin tunnel. I think that's the next place on my list of um. Places to uh, check the check the code of. I think it's I think it's the Goblin Tunnel. But first, I'm gonna trespass because no one who's gonna arrest me. I'm OSHA. Wait, does this loop all the way back around? Damn, chat! Look, we're all the way back at the very freaking beginning. What the hell? I don't know what this is a spoiler for, or a violation of, but I'm not gonna let them get away with it, whatever it is. Hello? Is anyone in here violating OSHA law? Kiwi and the banana. That banana looks like a like a dong, like two uh, balls and a penis, like a floppy schlong. And this feels like a violation of something. I'm 
calling I'm calling the police on that one. What is this place? I can't go this way. Chad, we better get out of here. We have no idea when the person who was here before is gonna come back and get us. It'd be probably for the best if we just leave. Let's just go to the scary cave. That's the next place on our list. Come along. Just make sure not to- Oh! 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 oh. Just make sure to watch out for all the holes and violations on this fa on this goddamn bridge. Oh! 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 See, that's exactly why you can't have that. Like, I, that was a full recreation of what could happen if you decide to go on a, a lovely trip with, like, your elderly grandpa to the, the rickety bridge. They might stump their fucking- they might, like, get their ankle jammed and then stumble over the railing. You never know. 45th fall bit today. Oh yeah, well, good news is, chat, mark my words, we're not gonna fall once once we're in the tunnels because that is instead then going to be a falling, stuff's going to be falling on us bit. That's the new bit once we get into the tunnels. You know, the tunnels where most of the OSHA workers that don't die at the dam die. You know, the... The, the tunnels. We don't, uh... We don't go in the tunnels, for the most part, because of the wild animals that live in there. Well, into the tunnels we go. Come along then, chat. Come along. Best get on with it then. We keep this place sealed from the outside because, uh, you know, because of the goblins. How's my reception? Oh my god. We're in the dark. Starberg really does have some cool caves. Yeah, I mean, none of all this is fucking extremely illegal, though. You're just, you're not supposed to have stuff like this. Uh, what is- you're supposed to, like, not allow people into, like, these tiny, narrow corridors like this. That's how you get stuck. Did I just hear a growl? Did I just hear scampering? Who's leaving these glow sticks around? That's someone's passport. And keys. I gotta get out of here. <laughs> I gotta get the hell out of here. Come on. Let's just, let's just go. Let's just go. Look, we're already at the end of it. Look, end of the tunnel. Did everyone have fun? Did everyone have fun in the tunnels? That was it. That was the whole tunnel, baby. Did you have fun? Did you remember to take pictures for the school project you're going on? Did you remember to take pictures? No. Oh. Uh, that's not good. That's not good. What is this imagery of what is happening? Missing. My doc. Last seen on the night of the 21st of February. She disappeared after I drank too much mushroom tea. She's made of wood and has blue pontoons. Reward. Tea party with me and my doc at my house. Please call 035-435-435. Oh, smells like something died in here. Probably because something did die in here. Hence the smell. Hello? What the fuck? Is that the corpse? You know, believe it or not, this ain't an OSHA violation. I can't, there's nothing to talk about with hey, this. Hey, uh, I found a dead body. Nothing. That's not funny, Mark. I'm serious. You mean like a dead animal? No, I'm pretty sure this is a dead guy. That's unsettling. Uh, 
I'll call the cops and they can come check it out. Yeah, I mean, like, here's the thing. Here's the thing. Here's the thing, boss. 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 Here's this the thing. Sort of building after here's the thing. The uh, fire they actually, believe it or not, did have a fire extinguisher time. in the room, and yeah, so I can't do anything. Anyway, I'm sure the cops will figure they out. Have they have exact. They have everything they need. Just continue on to the tunnels. Yep. All right, if you say so. Room's properly lit. It is draining. It's got everything someone could need. You might be able to argue that the light switch is is in the is in like a weird spot, but like aside from that, this is uh. No problems. You have a good day. <laughs> Scented candles to uh, override the horrible scent of a uh, dead body. Only one. Who fucking walks on a corpse? Someone with nothing to lose. And who also doesn't care about things like that. Me. Did I just pick up poop by accident? Is this poop? Oh, this is poop. <laughs> We get a better light. This might it might not be poop. That's poop. Fuck. That's an OSHA violation. You have to poop in the toilet. The door or the poop? Both. You can't have poop within five feet of a fucking door. What if someone slipped and fell? Let's keep moving. I've seen enough of this place. The poop is a violation, but not the dead guy? I mean, what do you want me to do? Charge the dead guy? He's already dead. Locked. There's Drowning gotta head. be a way to get this open. Yeah, we gotta be. There's gotta be a way to get in that area somehow. Huh. I keep thinking maybe one day my guy will learn how to swim. Oh, good. We have a chance to undo ta the time. All right, chat. Here we go. We are not gonna touch the poop this time. This time, I will not touch the poop. This time Smells I will like go something. in there and I will do everything as I should. What the fuck? Is that the corpse? Did it? Hey, uh, I found a dead body. And we don't That's go in there to touch the poop. We just I'm don't. Serious? You mean like a dead animal? No, I am pretty sure this is a dead guy. You get up to the second That's floor. Settling. Here we go. Platforming on a dead body. Well, why else would they put a dead body there? This is some sort of building after the cave when coming from the dam. What are you guys, it's just stupid? Yeah, I know the place. Anyway, I'm sure the cops will figure out what happened to the guy. It's definitely not safe to have this power line so low. Alright, if you say so. Hmm, but all this is to code. I mean, dead body or no, the guy knew how to take care of his building. Until he died. That is. At which point, honestly, the quality of the place kind of went down. Nothing seems to be working. So who just takes a heaving shit all over their fucking... I mean, I guess the same person who shits in a sink. Nothing seems to be working in the tunnel anymore. Almost all of the flood doors are stuck and have been missing valves. Surely Robin must have hidden them somewhere around here. Fortunately, I'll be retiring soon. Then Robin can deal with this mess on his own. Can't wait to see his stupid face when he hears about this. Eric. Blueprints, nothing. Files, nothing. Empty. Some kind of... The world's strongest beer. Battery. That makes two packs of spares for the camera. Wow, I cannot believe we had service here. I can't believe I immediately broke a cup. Flood door's main panel. Open that. Remember to turn the switches to match the right color code. If the light is on, you can open the tunnel door. What? I don't understand any of this. Oh. Well, let's see here. Flood doors main panel. Closed, automatic, recommended, open. Don't use this 
And yellow is not. Wait, no, wait, wait, wait. Is yellow automatic? I think we want yellow. And if we want yellow, that means we want A1 to B1 to B2 to B3 to C3 to D3 to D4. A1 going to B1, which is going to be aiming down, of course. Uh, which is going to go to B2, which is also going down. Which is going to go to B3, which is, of course, going to be going a smooth right. Which is going to go to C3, which is also going right. Which is going to go to D3, which is, of course, going to be aiming down. Which is going to go to D4, which aims down. Bazingus. All right, the door's open. Let's get the fuck out of here. That's Dakota, if I've ever seen it. All right, sir. Thank you for your time. I hope I didn't bother your nap. Uh, I've left a bill for the uh, for graffiti, broken window, and door uh, at your feet when you wake up. But not for the shit, of course. In this canon, in this timeline, I didn't see the shit. Stupid. Stupid idiot. You guys all dumb? I didn't see the shit in this timeline. So how would I take a picture of it? This is spooky room. This is illegal. I'm documenting this. This room's all freaking full of grass. Why? Not in my perfect OSHA, um... OSHA rules following world. Oh. Chat, this is... The old water tunnel. The tunnel. Let's see how this place is doing. I wouldn't get my hopes up. This is the tunnel. Ah, uh, well, the railings are fucking missing. That's for starters. Almost walked off. Railings fucking missing. Uh, that's gonna be... That's gonna be some... Some, uh, like, some, like, superhero punched a crater into one of the walls. Well, that's a good start. Uh, which isn't good. Uh, I think, like, a Hulk came through and, like, just smashed a fucking crater into one of the walls. Uh, the flood door opens just fine, though. Is there anything I should know about? I didn't check it before I... I didn't check the warning sign before I... Let me see here. Uh, if the light is green, the area behind the door is not flooded and safe for entry. Why am I starting to stop hearing? Oh. Whoa! Damn, I got strong legs. I'm also sealed in here as of a couple seconds ago. Well, chat, here we are. The tunnels. You ever gotten stuck in the old Bergman tunnels before? Yeah, believe it or not, you can just turn them all on. Yep. There's actually no safety problems with that. You just turn them all on. Why? Robin, if you lost your keys again, you need to open... What the fuck? FB12 and turn on A2, B1, and C3. Fuck you, suck my dick. How about that? Which one of these is FB12? Wait a minute. What? A2, B1, we're just gonna turn on A2, B1, C3. Try to keep up, chat. You ever followed lines before? Wait, which ones did I have to do? Mm -mm -mm. A2, B1, and C3. All right, A2, B1, C3. A2, Bazongas. B1, Bazongas. C3, Bazongas. Doors open. It's as simple as that. Try to keep up next time, all right? This ain't hard. But this is, <laughs> this is going in the catalog. Oh yeah, what is that? What is that, black mold? Is that black mold? Oh yeah. Something's wrong. Yeah, it's all mold. Top to bottom, it's all mold. Can't believe this place. Where the fuck am I? Here's a map of all the things that are broken and some points of interest. Oh yeah, okay. Uh, thanks. Um, well then it doesn't look like I need to explore anymore here. I'll just take a picture of that. Fascinating. Yep, now we've got everything. That makes two packs of spears for the camera. Why not just open all of them? A 
and turn on all the power. On, on, on. Yep, just turn it all on. There we go. Poof. Everything's on. That's immediately locked. Why is that? I believe I specifically requested everything to be on. <laughs> All right, well that's door two. Why would uh, why would um, why would that not be on uh, after I? Oi! Door two flooded. Door two got a flood problem, but I don't care. I, I do, I want to say this as gently as possible. I do not care. I want to go that way. I want to go that way now. So open the freaking door before I, I do something ridiculous. Okay. It says don't go there no matter what. Do I hear the sound of water flowing? For a second I thought the door was listening to me, but it wasn't. All right, that's fine. What is, uh, what does my mean? You need to, oh, I didn't see this. You need to reset the controls after using the levers. See, Chad, it's not flooded. It's not flooded, see? See, if it was flooded, there'd be water. Stupid. If it was flooded, there would be water. Now I just gotta open up door one. Ah, uh, that one didn't turn on enough. On now. Chat, there's something wrong with this fucking door. It's not opening. I don't think I'm supposed that to go that way. Two pairs of spares for the flashlight. I think I've just got some warning. Noise area may cause hearing loss. Use proper ear protection. Did you guys all pack your uh, hearing protection? Did you guys all pack your uh, your hearing your noise coverage? Also, watch out because, like, a, a controller might turn around the corner any second now and blow up our heads. You never know what you're gonna find in a place like this. Beyond that, which OSHA can control. This is what many people call the realm beyond realms. Place where OSHA has no control. And I don't listen to violation complaints. The Bergman Group was a great company founded by Eric Kleinman. Where's the Sandberg. bathroom? Is there a bathroom here? I'd say that company played a big part in rebuilding the city. Somehow That's three packs of camera batteries. That's three packs. Anyway. Sanderberg was a vital part of that company. When he disappeared, the Bergman group started having trouble staying afloat. I see. Ultimately, the other shareholders forced Clydeman to sell his share of the company. He became okay, a but who asks? Now who asks? Clydeman yeah, no, that's what I'm saying, dude. Someone to guide him. This is this is me when lore starts playing in a video game, you know what I mean? Just, uh, just don't care. And he needs me. This is me when Lore played. 
All right, well, let's get to it then, Chad. Let's get to it then. This should open up nice and safely. There it is, water. We got a flood. You know, I fucking cannot believe I did that. Uh-oh. Well, who knows? Maybe we don't need that. That might be some kind of, uh, uh, like, trick. You know? Mm, I'm gonna pull this one and this one. <laughs> Why is this not turning on? <laughs> I, I thought I made it clear I wanted this to turn on. all means yeah copy that yeah yeah you uh you guys making any sense out of this year uh this year technology we obviously want to convert the signal to on oh wait does on i think this all means on actually when I look at these pressure dials, I see we uh, have an overall pressure of um, about, what, about a neutron star. Uh, and there it is. This button doesn't fucking work. Let me see here. We want to obviously turn the S1D to down and the S2U to up, which is going to transfer the power to the other side of the... And uh, hang on here. I actually do think I want that one up, that one down. Uh, now we turn this off and we wait 30 seconds for that to fix itself. While that's happening, we'll throw this lever. Oh, there it is. We gotta hit E1, E2, E3, 4, and E5 to send the power properly. Now, when we go over here, we click on and press the button, nothing happens. We have to uplink to the control center. It, may, it all makes sense now. And now we swim across. We can't do that. Well, hmm. The one thing I'm, I'm struggling to realize is if uh, up means on or off because it's showing on. I mean, I, surely it's down is on. Surely. Surely. But I am going to say this is all an OSHA violation. This uh, is unbelievable, like almost Silent Hill-esque design. Door B2, no. Well, we have all the numbers for these. I need to power up whatever this is. Which is S1U and S2D. Now, if I want S1U and S2D on, then I need E2 and E4 and 5 on. Did it. You guys thought I was a fucking idiot. Robin, don't climb on the roof again. I'd like to see you make it. So now we have to power up the blue one, which is obviously if you want to power up the blue one, you're going to want to turn on S1D and S2U, which means turn off all of these things. S1D is E1, and S2U is going to be E3. Yeah. And now we just kind of hit the button. What about the valve wheel? Shut up. Shut the fuck up. I 
I have no idea what I did. What is happening? Oh, I need this door opened. This door is locked. I can't get out. We have to find a key to open that door. All I know is that that guy was complaining about Robin climbing on the roof. So I guess I need to. Oh, fuck you, Robin. You piece of shit. All right, fine. We'll play your little game, Robin. Oh. It's just beer. Whatever. We done did it. We done did it. No one can take that from me. Thank God there are no actual floods in any of these rooms, or I would be so freaking dead. Gasp. An OSHA violation. When will they learn? Should I know what I haven't needed so far? Only one pack of batteries left. That wheel. You wanna know why? Because we didn't need the wheel. You wanna know why? Because I don't need it. What the fuck is all this? What is all this? Um... Cat. You know, it's actually... Not, you're not allowed to have this kind of stuff. It distracts you. Interesting. In the workplace. In, oh, wait. We were looking at this. Eric Kleidman. We got some evidence of Zanderberg's disappearance from a reliable source. It appears to be true that Jeff Walter really did kidnap Berg. He needed him for some secret project. Mayor Altmayer didn't, I either didn't know anything about it or he was lying. But the government, the governor might know something because he supported Walter's secret project before Walter disappeared. We need to get some information out of him. There's also that cop, Max Kohler who's been leading an investigation of Walter's disappearance. He might actually be one of Walter's henchmen. If that's the case, he probably knows where he's hiding. Hartman. That makes two packs of spares for the flashlight. Open up every flood door. I don't know what any of those buttons do yet. I gotta do it carefully. All right, so let's see here if I can figure out how the hell this is all working. This door doesn't open. So where the hell am I? Man, this game does not like ladders. What is this? Bergman Group's shady downfall raises new questions. Ah, uh, just some dirty, uh, dirty images of like miners. Shit, unconcerning. The only thing I'm concerned about is these flood doors. This door won't freaking open. I need to open up D5. I'm gonna have to get D5 open. There we go. And there's no flooding. Take it to the bank, chat, not one. <laughs> I'm fine. C1 locked. C2 open. C3 fine. What's beyond the door? All right. It's all looking clear. Floodgates A1 emergency override. If the alarm sounds as emergency override, can be used to manually open A1 and A2. To access the flood door control panel, all floodgates must be open. I'm about to. Am I really about to fuck up some serious shit? Well, that's an OSHA violation. There's supposed to be a wheel there. What's that about? 
it's weird because I look there and I think there's supposed to be like some kind of freaking wheel there. Oh my god. Um. I did something. Fuck. The sun is coming down. Ah! Uh, I have to get these doors open. I don't have any wheels for these, man! <laughs> Stuff's not looking good, chat! Stuff's not looking good at all, chat! What, what did you do? I tampered. I did what OSHA does. I tampered. I was just, I was playing around. Broken. Wait. Wait for what, damn it! Oh my god. Oh my god. Shit. I fucked up big time. I made a big mistake. And now, we're all gonna pay for it. Fucking floodgates went back down. Wait. Huh, huh, huh. Code 0451. Oh, four, five, one. I'm dead. I'd take a picture if I could. I, um. I blame the secure the safety of this building. Should have waited. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Shut up now. So what the fuck was I supposed to do? Okay, that was gonna open up the flood door so I could escape. Okay, I see what was happening. I, I fumbled at the beginning, but everything's gonna be fine. I have to get these doors. We're gonna be okay. Everything's gonna be just fine. Everyone just calm down. No one's gonna die to an OSHA accident today. But I am documenting this. That should not be broken. I can't believe this game is 35 hours long. It's like eight or 10 chapters. And we're on chapter three. It's very long. I did it, I saved the world. I did it. Now to wait until the gate opens. Remember it's O. It's 0451. Come on. Come on. Can I text someone about this? I don't have time. Oh, four, five, one. Go, go, go! Way too close. Document it. Do uh, document it. Document something here. What is this? This place is a death trap. You guys think the elevators work? Y'all think the elevator? Y'all think it's safe to take these elevators? Whoever is this thing? 50 bucks, it doesn't kill me. 
Hmm. Well, yeah, the elevator works. The elevator works. We can't complain about that. All right, elevator Chan, let's get this party underway. You gotta get me the hell out of here. I'm very important, an important man. Get me back to the surface where I belong. I don't want to die. I'll take that 50 now. <laughs> That's 50 bucks to me, asshole. That's what I was, I didn't get, you didn't let me finish. Oh my God. That's a violation! You can tell by the sparks that the elevator fell. Hang on, hey, whoa, 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 hey. That's going in my cringe compilation, dude. That's going right in the cringe compilation. Document it. Cringe. <laughs> the last. Last thing the OSHA guy ever says. Just let me on, just let me on, let me on. It's elevator, better Obligatory fall bit. Would you believe me if I told you this game is a little flighty for a source game? The guy doesn't like stop as fast as you'd like him to. No. Yeah, that's dangerous as fuck, man. Only two packs left. Yeah, that's super freaking dangerous, man. Shouldn't have jinxed it. The fuck are we? Dude, we almost died. But we lived. I love how calm Mark is despite everything that's happened. Chat, that's what happens when you live as an OSHA man. Okay? You're all panicking, but this is a this is a Monday to him. This is Monday. This is Monday. Okay. I'm feeling like it's a calzone night, chat. I don't know. I don't know, chat. Tonight's feeling like a calzone night. Mm, 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 mm. That's going in the violations. I, 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 there should have been emergency wheels. I'm gonna be honest. There, there should have been emergency wheels. There weren't any. Finally, we're back outside. Thank God. You know, Chad, that could have gotten pretty bad for us. But we lived. What's the problem over here? I saw something weird. I'm pretty sure that's not meant to be like that. Yeah, there's not supposed to be like, uh, like spooky scrawlings on the walls. Hello? Hello? Wondering where the- oh, don't want to die. Pink card. That's a- that's a key card. We can use that to access new areas. In the pink section. Wow, this section of the fucking place is nice. It's too bad you're not supposed to have blue wheels with red piping. It's me. I'm somewhere near the Bergman towns. I actually got out there before the ceiling caved in. Are you serious? I'm always serious. Now I'm at this control center of sorts. What do I do? There should be a way to enter another part of the tunnels from there. I'm not very comfortable sending you down there again, but it's invaluable that we know the full extent of the damage. I'll take care of it. Thanks. I'm going back in, baby. Wait, no, no, I was joking, 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 I was joking. Fuck! 
Sometimes I don't even know what it's my guy's me. taking pictures I'm of. I'm somewhere near the Bergman tunnels. I barely got out there before the ceiling caved in. Are you serious? I'm always serious. Now I'm at this control center of Wait. sorts. What the what fuck are do? you doing here, there man? There should be a way to enter another part of the tunnels from there. What the fuck you doing here, man? There again. But it's invaluable that oh, I told you never to show your face the around these parts again I'll if you knew it was good for you. Thanks, Mark. That I warned you never to come back here. Or oh, you'd face my wrath. Pumping A3 and day 4 Leave Teddy Chan alone? How about you get the hell out of my face before I make you? How about you get the heck out of my face before I break you in half? How about that? How do you think OSHA people, like, secure their fucking, you know, you know, their rules? They have to defend themselves. You know how many lives I've taken on the job? Multiple. Okay. More than one. A couple. And I take another in a heartbeat. The number's higher than zero, is what I'm trying to say. Damn, this place is nice. Hello? Anyone? Hey, it's me. I'm in the tunnels. There's something wrong with the red pipes. Don't turn on pumps A1 or A2. The water's really polluted. Did I just turn on A1 and A2? Did I just, did I literally just turn on A1 and A2 poisoning the water supply of the entire city? They got the botch. <laughs> Oops, all botch. It's all botch in there, baby. It's all botulism. You got the botulism now. <laughs> Hell yeah. All botch. By the way, Mark's accidentally dropped the other tunnel keys into the pool. Marco accidentally dropped the other tunnel keys into the pool. I couldn't find them. But I'll take another look once the pool is drained. Just need to close the pumps. The pumping station key is on the table. What is all this? Close. 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 Open. Close. Am I about, am I doing like something, am I doing this on the house? Am I like turning on chlorination for everyone on the house so as to keep people from being poisoned? Because I see what I have to do. I think I have to make sure I chlorinate the water so that everyone drinks chlorine water so they don't die. Even though I don't think you want to chlorinate the water. I think that would be just as bad. I don't think people are supposed to, that's a violation. I can't. I'm not getting credit for it, but it is. That's three packs of flashlight batteries. Do you chlorinate water people drink? I think that's against the rules. I don't think you want to drink a lot of chlorine. Maybe a little. Maybe you can handle like a little. Like a like a like a like a, a little bit. A little a little small amount. But I'm pretty sure you don't want to catch much. Remember that I left that wheel there. What is this? What am I opening right now? I don't even know. Okay. This one too. No, I'll open both of them. I don't know what I'm turning. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm in my element. I'm just hanging. I'm just hanging out, touching things. Pop me. That one's open. All right, they're all open. Hell yeah. I think I just opened A1 and A2, releasing the botch. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's the botch. You can smell it. That's pure raw botch. Oh, yeah. Yep. That's the... I just released botch. Now, uh, where the hell is, uh... It's three oh, no. of camera batteries. Whoa! That was close. I need to get the chlorine on. 
Where do we keep all the clean stuff? Marco, my friends at the lab finally gave me the results of your sample. The large amounts of metal in the water go past the limits for drinking water by more than tenfold. Bacteria levels are also well above standards. I'm guessing it has something to do with the new mine. Don't tell anyone or we'll lose our jobs. Yikes. Uh, I'm taking a picture of that. Interesting. Poor Marco is about to get dragged, dude. I'm about to fuck Marco up. I'm about to really fuck him up. I'm about to destroy them. So I'm guessing this is the chlorine section. Uh, is what I'm gonna guess. But, uh, I don't have a way to open that door. I need to get that chlorine on. Where the hell do we have the chlorine? Is this stuff supposed to be, like, boarded up? I don't know if that's supposed to be boarded. What if I just make it all chlorine? Is that gonna get me in trouble? If I just make the entire- is that another pink card? So I guess if I didn't find it the first time, I could find it again. Oh yeah, here we go! That's the- that's the chlorine output pipe! Somewhere in here is what we're looking for. Oh yeah, bada bing. Here we go. Ah. Uh, the fuck is the chlorine? Oh yeah, this is the, this is it, this is it, this is it. You gotta go into the deep, 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 deep depths to find the chlorine. High voltage. Why do I not have the keys to access these sections? Was I not, like, provided the opportunity to open these things? Entrance. I have to go- you're telling me I have to go in the pipe. You're telling me I'm going to load myself inside of it. Wow, that's kind of scary, dude. That's like a guy. See that? That's like a spooky guy. I mean, all right, I will go in there. Let me just uh, find a, a usable wheel. Here's one, I remember leaving this one. I also might have to turn off all the water flow after I do this, but let's figure it out once I've gotten the wheel done. This sounds unwise. But it's not unwise, all right? The only thing unwise is leaving the people of this city to die of botulism poisoning because I poisoned the entire water supply, all right? That's unwise. Hang on, I have to cut all the water pumps. Wrong color. Dude. You really think that this You, you, you really think that the fucking, uh, wheel can tell what color it's being put into? Or, like, what the hole can tell what color it's being put into? Not me. I don't think so. Also, all the colors look the same. They all look exactly the same. Now shut the hell up. You're distracting my gaming. You're really pissing me off. I'm going in. And you're coming with me. I grab you. And uh, you're coming with me. If I'm gonna die, it's gonna be on, uh, it's gonna be with you, all right? You're gonna be with me the whole time. We're gonna die in there together, that's what's gonna happen. 
You're lucky I'm freaking lost and I don't know where I am. No, frick you. Frick you! I haul you faster. You're lucky I, do I still don't know where I am. I'm completely lost. I'm lost. Frick. Alright, I'm back on track. Yes. Yes. Behold. That's green, but what the- but chat, but chat, but chat, but chat, but chat. If you look closely here, that's a circle. And if you look closely there, that's also a circle. It's a green circle, though. I have to- yeah, what we should do instead of trying to get a green wheel is just find some fucking paint. We'll just paint it green. And the game will shut the fuck up about it. We'll just have to get some paint. Does anyone know where I can find some paint? Not much to worry about here. Where the fuck am I gonna find the wheel I need? I think I saw a green wheel, but it was locked behind like a door. Man, I don't know how to open a door. How many times I gotta tell you to get the fuck out of here, man? That wasn't green. Am I, like, missing a key on the ground that I literally can't see in a million years and never will? Why does that feel like what's happening today? Might have fucked yourself over? Oh, you think so? Are you sure? Are you fucking sure about that? Because last I checked, that wheel doesn't matter, and there's only, like, two more wheel slots, and neither of them have the color blue on them. So, uh, I'm not too sure about that one. I'll show you. I'll open up the guide, and it'll tell me exactly what I want to know. And then you're gonna look like a freaking idiot. And you're gonna look like a moron! Shit, that wasn't the light. SOMEONE TELL ME WHERE THE KEY IS! RIGHT NOW! You think I'm playing around? I'm gonna start doing- I'm- I'm getting farther away from the alarm. Every moment we spend not finding the key is another moment this gets louder! I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Wait a minute. That's not- that's- that's the code. Nothing to worry about. Where the fuck is the key? I need- I need a way to get the- the, the fucking wheel I saw. I remember seeing one. It's literally right there. But this door doesn't- Oh God, oh my God. Oh Jesus Christ, Lord in heaven. Oh my God. Guys, it's okay. I just checked. I checked, look. This one has a green paint and that's why it fits inside the green one. No, no. I'm going in, baby. Wee -oo, wee -oo, wee -oo, wee -oo. 
Until we solve the puzzle, the alarm doesn't turn off. Wait, but... Well, we are in scary piping. Alone. In the silence. Chat? We never solved the water problem. We poisoned everyone and then fucking cut the water supply entirely and then left. We gave everyone in city the, in the city the botch and then left. Sounds like a them problem, not a me problem. Yep. Mm, mm, mm. So that's why I drink uh, bottled water. No risk of the botch. Can't get the botch out of the bottled. Well, not as much. Lower chance of the botch. You know how it is. This is where you would use a wheel to close that so people couldn't escape into your facility. Yeah. You gotta be. F what is. F what is this? What is this, my guy? What just happened to you? Are you kidding me? Can't survive like a five foot fucking fall? I got bad legs and bad arms and bad bones. I can't function, I can't live, I can't breathe. Ah, uh, I'm dying. He is a man of safety. Dude, shut up. Shut up! Could survive this. Yep. Chat, this fall was. I jumped at about the fifth rung of the ladder. This guy broke his legs on a six foot fall and fucking blacked out and died. Just to let you all know. We're in Silent Hill. Everyone shut the fuck up. All right, Pyramid Head could be anywhere. He almost died doing that. It's a violation. Any more violations I should know about? I can't go that way. Someone broke in here before me. Something's freaking wrong. Hello? 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 Only two packs left. Hello? Uh, Only two packs left. It's me. I'm from OSHA. I'm here to take pictures of how messy this fucking tunnel is. Is anyone here? I'm not gonna get got by like a fucking monster, right? Oh, we're back here again. Well, chat, back in the tunnel. Made it all the way back. That's three more packs batteries. of flashlight batteries. Oh, yeah. I mean, this may have been my fault. Did I do that? <laughs> Did I do that? His delivery was not the best, but he tried. Let's get the batteries back on. Did I do that? It wasn't really my fault. I mean, it really wasn't his fault. Like, this is 100% the fault of the people who, like, built this place. This is not his fault. I think we can all agree on that. I wouldn't fucking blame him for what happened here. I would blame him for the botch. If you get botch today, if you get botulism today, I blame Mark for your botch. If you get the botch. But if you don't get the botch, then I wouldn't worry about it. I'm pretty sure that's not meant to be like that. Wait a minute, what the fuck is this? Who's like living here? Hello? 
Raft is ready for another deliver delivery for the distributors at the open sewer, leaving for the long and dangerous journey when the raft can be fully loaded. What? <laughs> I have five. Is someone delivering like drugs down like the fucking dam with a raft? No fucking way is this a old timey like hand built wooden raft. No! Call up! Tell on them! My. No. No, 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 no. Next time you make a delivery, don't trust that idiot Matt with distribution. He's already in great debt to us, yes. That is some guy who are mine. who ruined my logging business. That is the same guy who ruined my logging business. No wonder he now lives in an open sewer. He deserved it! Oh my god. They have a lovely indoor sauna inside the sewer. How does this work? Oh my god. 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 What do I do? What do I do? Okay, I can stir by leaning with my body. Ah! Oh my god! Take pictures as we go. We still have a we have a job to do, god damn it. We have a job to do, god damn it! Uh oh. We're gonna be fine. We're gonna be fine. What happens if I touch the wall? We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Barrels are falling. There's still earthquakes happening. We gotta be careful, but we should still keep trying to take pictures as we go. Uh, is there like slime that's gonna fall out of that tank? No, we're fine. Alright, well, I mean, you know, it's bad, but it's not that bad. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Only one pack of batteries left. It's gonna be our last pack, man! Don't gotta worry about more packs after this, we're gonna die! Lane. You know, if you look really carefully, you can see the exact moment when I took a picture of the fucking roof caving in. Is there like a monster chasing us? No, we're fine. We're fine, everything's fine. Everyone just stay calm. That's the thing. Is that a actual just full-on cave tunnel coming up? Oh my god. No fucking way is the back just gonna cave in behind me. Uh. Oh! Oh! Oh my god. Oh my god! Everything's fine. It's just that no one will come for me if I die down here. No one. No one fucking cares about Mark. Not after he gave everyone in, in the city the botch. No one. No one's gonna lose even a wink of anything. That was just a bad dream. That's what could have happened if I was the worst driver, but I'm not. Let's all just stay focused. All right, we're fine. Everything's fine. Whatever you do, don't go that way. You wanna go this way. That way is where the, that way's bad. No, even this isn't really to OSHA code. It's got a hole in it. I don't want to like... Yeah, that's exactly why you can't have a hole like that. That's like a load-bearing hole. You just can't do that. I wasn't looking at the screen yet. Did I just bonk my face on a beam? Oh, fuck. <laughs> Donk. All right, well, I mean, we survived. No one can take that from me.
All right, perfect. How much longer does this go for? As much as I love raft sequence. Haven. No one can tell what the fuck that is. That just looks like a pile of rocks. This looks like someone forgot their hard hat. Yeah, really, they really do act like they just forgot about the hard hat. Like, I packed it. I wore it. Was I supposed to, like, unpack it from the car, like, legit, and I just, like, forgot? Because you'd think it would be fine. Like, I absolutely packed the hard hat. Where are the alligators? I don't know. I don't know. It feels like we're going to die soon, you know? Also, can this raft go any faster? Like, all I'm gonna say is it's kind of slow, man. It's kind of slow. I'm hungry. I think I put in that order for that calzone now. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. It's, it's, <laughs> it's calzone time. Or is it? It is. It is. It is. It is. It is. It, it is. It is. It's all. It's a perfect time for calzones. Calzone is just worse pe pizza. How about you? Uh, how about you go to hell? Yeah. Look, dude. I eat calzones because calzones. Dude. All right. All right. I know I got a lot of shit earlier about eating pizza with my with a fork and a knife. Uh, what about calzones? Calzones are a fork and knife food. You can't, you don't eat a calzone with your hands. You're gonna get, you're gonna get greased to hell. What the fuck is literally a pizza pocket? Dude, if you're eating a calzone- What is this? Is this made out of scotch tape? Is this fucking raft scotch tape? Like, like really scotch tape? What is this made out of? Go, go, you're gonna fucking hit the wall. Dude, just learn how to swim. Oh my god. What is that green light? I'm gonna die. Chad, what is that green light? You see that green light? That's an anomaly. That's an anomaly. Get ready to take a picture of this. All right? That's an artifact. That's an anomaly. It's actually making vibrating sounds. Hello? What the fuck is... Uh, yeah. Uh... What the fuck? Um, got anything to say about this, Mark? 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 Got anything to say about this, Mark? 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 The only picture he wanted to take was of the tunnel. He didn't care about the mushrooms, for the record. Mark? Anything to say about that part, Mark? That is a toxic barrel spill, Mark. You were supposed to go that way. I was supposed to land at the toxic barrels. The game wanted me to turn that way. How far is it going to knock me back? Oh my God. Oh wait, no, it isn't. It's going to put me right here. Okay. The game was uh, the game was directing me towards the barrels. I was trying to avoid it because it looked like radiation. This is all within our show. Yeah, I mean, it is. It's just like, you'd think Mark would have something to say about it. Plus, there's like scary music playing. What the f <laughs> Mark, my guy. Mark, my guy. My guy, Mark. 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 You submerged about two inches into the water, Mark. You coughed and breathed in all of the all of the water. He touched the water and went <coughs> and <just> like <laughs> inhaled all of his lungs full of water in an instant. Please! 
This is the hardest part of the whole game. Maybe I really am supposed to go around. No, it looks way too deliberately shaped. We're landing there. We must. <laughs> nope, that is actually full on poisonous kill mushrooms. If you touch them, you die. All right, I guess my character just wasn't close enough to the wall last time I tried to go around that side. Cause it like, it felt like it was pulling me towards that side. Maybe that was Mark's subconscious wanting to get near those mushrooms. This raft is not very sturdy. Uh, yeah, I mean, it's mainly chat. What it is, is it's mainly the scotch tape. You only barely make this turn. What the hell's going on here? Mark, say something about the mushrooms. Mark, say something about the mushrooms. Last batteries. That's all you have to say, Mark? I don't know which way to go now. Guess I'll go the wide way that seems safer. There it is. There's the end. That has to be the actual end. Strange tunnels, chat. But hey, you know, we made it to the end. We're gonna jump off. Look at this scenic view. Look at this, look at this beautiful place. Good old Hydro Dam B4. It's like we're so far away from all the, you know, all the, all the bullshit we had to deal with before. We won't have to worry about the botch here. We're officially past state lines. I'm afraid to try to get onto this fucking land. Am I stopping here? I don't think I'm stopping here. No, we are. Okay, we, we were supposed to stop. to assume those are just shoes and not a body sticking out of the ground. I'm going to assume that that's just shoes. Can't go that way. What I can do is go this way and do some sick parkour. Hop, hop! Just like that. Get to this side. Which, I mean, we also could have just gone this way from the start, but shut up. I'm going in. Hello? Looking for batteries, running low. We got new version of this piece of shit. It's way better. Notice, this can only be used when the generators are turned on. Gotta turn the generators on. Gotta get these generators on or we ain't doing nothing. A pack of spare batteries for the camera. Which means you now using the floodgates anyways. Gotta get the generator on. Where the hell would that be? That's me, I'm Angie. I'm mad. I can't. I'm. I'm just not even gonna bother. All it says at the bottom is, "Don't turn on generator G2." The rest is so dark. All right, chat. So just don't turn on generator G2. We know the rules. That makes two packs of spares for the camera. The question is. Will I listen to that rule? Or will I do my thing? Which is to say, 
do some real OSHA BS. Let's see. Will I pull a classic OSHA and just kind of flick some switches? Get this place up to code, even if it kills us all? All right, let's see here. Enter the code to turn off the alarms. Well, all I see is that the guy had some red uh, Cheetos, so which means it's, uh, wait, that means it can't be six, seven, eight, eight. Unless there's another code that does something else. Well, let's just turn on the generators. Oh, what the fuck is that? Is that a rock? It scared me. That's three packs of camera batteries. This place is cursed? Yeah, this place is cursed. There's like dead bodies everywhere. There's rocks moving around. Now the generators are on. Generator two, I order you to turn on now. Solved it. Then Stahlberg Steel went bankrupt. It was one of my company's major clients. After that, our revenue shrunk to almost nothing. I see. Eventually, I had no choice but to sell the company. I was about to close the deal with a man who could have been able to save the company. But he backed out at the last minute. My only option was to sell the company to Jeff Walter, the man whose last two business acquisitions had resulted in bankruptcy. I see. Of course, I had my doubts about the acquisition, but I figured it would be better than nothing. Little did I know that it would lead to such an unsafe living environment. I'm not listening to the rules. Ultimately, the Override it and turn it the fuck on. My wife. All right, this place is powered. I'm going to find him and make him taste his own medicine. Three packs left. Three packs left. The, pa the place is on. The generators all say they're on. There we go. There we fucking go, chat. That's this place powered the hell on. You know what that means. We can see, we can see slightly better. Let's get upstairs. It's time to tinker around with some things the OSHA way. Let's get the hell upstairs and get to work. Now we can release the botch into the rivers. We can imagine all the different places we can unleash the botch now. Flood doors open. Flood doors. Turn light all green. Turn all the floodlights green. Warnings. Alarm. Good. Flood doors. I don't want to mess with any of that. Systems on, warnings two, no problems there. All right, I think every door should be good now. Now I should be able to leave. Right? 
Yes, I suppose so. I suppose that should take care of everything we need. This door is good. Yes, I suppose with this, everything should be taken care of, yes. Yes. Hell, we can even leave that way if we so chose, which I, I mean, I don't, but we could if we so chose. I think it's time we leave this place. There is no flood behind this door. Yes. Let us get settle. Onwards. Down the scary tunnel. Without a raft. Oh, I didn't take any freaking pictures while I, eh, I gave I gave up on that. Why? 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 How do I get A3 open? Why? Where's my raft? This game is like the king of, but wait, there's more. When, whenever I think I've done something, the game goes hee hee. Woo. But you got one more thing, streamer. But streamer, you got one more thing you gotta take care of before you can get out my spooky mine. I mean, like, I like the game, but it's like, damn, man. Let me leave, man. Just let me go. Blood doors. All doors are good. System. System on. Okay, system currently on. Flood doors, alarm. Yeah, everything's fine. Flood doors. Reset doors. There we go. We had to reset the doors. Now, all doors are green, including red door. Fixed it. Fixed your door. I'm gonna keep running and pretend I didn't hear a loud slam, almost as if someone broke into the building and is after me. I'm out of here. We're just gonna get out of here, chat. Come on, everyone. Come on, everyone. Why is this not opening? It says green. I can't pull, I can't oh, uh, wheel the door. Even though it says it should open. Do I have to go back up and reset it again? It won't let me open it. Fuck, I think I gotta go reset it one more time. Damn you doors! My one weakness! Oh, OSHA! I have to check the goddamn door! This is all your fault. You and your codes. Turn lights red. Turn lights green. Turn off. Warnings. Alright, this should now be a mint condition system. So help me God. Okay. I'd bet my life on this door opening for me right now. Done everything by the books. Nothing more to go wrong. All the generators. Are on. This door isn't opening. What if I just had to drown myself? I did everything right, dude. It's not opening. I think it bugged. I think it might actually be bugged. I'm gonna try jumping in the water and drowning myself. Quickly reset it. Okay, and ladies and gentlemen, that's OSHA. Thank, thank you, everyone. <laughs> I'm not doing that whole puzzle again. I just won't. 
I just won't. But I had a lot of fun playing it. Hope you all had a lot of fun watching. I'll be back tomorrow at 3.30 p.m. EST. I got two more days of streaming before Thursday when I leave for a couple days to play uh, the new hot game. So I don't have the whole thing spoiled for me. Well, yeah, chat, thanks for watching. I hope you had a good time. I will see you then. Thank you if you gifted subs and donated. Gave me bits. I appreciate it all very much. We'll be back at 3.30 p.m. EST tomorrow. I don't know what I'm playing. But I'll see you then. Goodbye, chat. Goodbye. Goodbye.